Yo, what's going on guys? What is going on? Today, we've got a sick stream, hopefully. Hopefully, hopefully. I could also get completely screwed by RNG, but such is the nature of Dark and Darker these days. We are all slaves to the multi-classing loot boxes. But you know what? I'm here for it. We're going to give it a go. I got super lucky because they upgraded the, uh, the XP of all of our characters. And what happened with me is my cleric perfectly hit level 30. So I don't have to play this piece of shit ever again. I never want to touch this stupid, slow, bald POS, dude. I hate him. I hate him so much. But he's level 30, so we don't have to worry about that. Um... Maestra, what up, dude? Euthyphro content always on top, dude. That is a very nice thing to say. I think the Euthyphro viewers are always on top. I think I have the best viewers ever. Karam got five magical healing on your first two rolls. That is sick. That's what we we're hoping to do today. Is it not 35? No, no, no. You only need the character to be level 30. You get your first learning token at 35, but the character itself only has to be level 30. So, like... If we go over here and we go to, uh, oh, thank God, bro. You actually did have me worried for a second, but yeah, I can, I can choose my, uh, my cleric now and get some tokens. <laughs> um, but yeah, dude, we're, we're in it. We're multi-class and officially today. I haven't done any pools. I saved them all for stream because I wanted it to be hype. I'm, it's funny because IRL, I hate gambling. I'm, I'm just so not into, uh, the feeling of, Knowing that the, the the deck is stacked against me, but in games, I'm all in for the loot boxes, bro. I'm all in for the RNG card pack token pool loot box slot machine. I'm in it. I'm in it. We hyped. That's goddamn right, Dustin. What you do? You multi class with Wizard. Uh, Staff Master is pretty cool, but honestly, I feel like Wizard's better to just take the Warlock stuff as opposed to the other way around. But yeah, I also have reward tokens. I can rip these open. We got loot boxes on top of loot boxes. There's two different types of loot boxes we have to open today, and I am so hyped for it, dude. I'm so hyped. So, should we get started? I think we'll start with the reward tokens. I saw a bunch of people in general chat earlier saying you could get freaking like uniques and stuff. I mean, supposedly everybody had a famine or a freaking full gore that got deleted when they rolled it back. I'm sure all of them were telling the truth. So let's see if we can get some ourselves. We got 12 tries. I have no idea what's even in here. I've not, I've not opened a single one of these. So we're just going to start ripping. Uh, okay. Sick, dude. Where'd it go? Where the hell did it go, dude? Oh, it's here. Oh, it's sick. It's good. <laughs> Hell yeah. All right. Why doesn't it go in my inventory? I'm going to lose it over here. Whatever, bro. We're, we're opening the next one. That wasn't that was cool, but it's not that hype. Uh, we got the Louis V, the rugged boots or the Wanderers attire. Yikes, bro. Now, this is actually just going to clog my sash. This sucks. What? <laughs> Shit. Here, we'll, we'll transfer the gold bags into the inventory. Prepare, so we can look at the loot. Uh, so far... Mid. I'm gonna say it, mid. We got 10 more to go. Let's go. We get... Okay, what are these, bro? These suck. What? Well, I guess Dark Play is kind of good. Too agy. I mean, that's Dece, right? I'm not really like a plate lock kind of guy, so I don't really give a shit about this. But uh, we go again. Uh, 400 gold or some garbage. Oh, I already know which one I'm picking. All right, these are mid. These are so mid. You had 20 and got shit. Well, right behind you, bro. Right behind you. <laughs> okay, shadow mask. This could be something. Give me two true, three knowledge. We got shit. All right, well, Mr. Uh, who's even giving me this stuff? This weird classmaster wizard? Screw you, classmaster. You suck. Warhammer, Nasalhelm, Straw Hat. 
Yikes, dude. These loot boxes suck, dude. Okay, this is what we gotta do. We gotta get the shit luck out of the way on the reward tokens, because I don't actually care about that. This, this is where we need the RNG, the, the RNGesus to bless us here. Uh, straight up, I'm just gonna sell some of this stuff, because this loot is nothing to write home about. I mean, nobody buys straw hats, right? I actually have no idea. I've not sold one. Yeah, screw that. Mr. Armorsmith, you look like you'd like a straw hat. Matter of fact, this guy would look good in a straw hat, right? I think so. He should put that shit on. Uh, get out of my face. Get out of my face. This power is actually kind of good. Th these are actually these. You'll take the hat? Oh, my bad. <laughs> Armorsmith was too quick, bro. He, he hit me up right away. What am I going to do? <laughs> yeah, maybe I should give him away. I'll, I'll give I'll give anything else away if I if I don't want it here. Uh, okay, we got six more to go. Six more to go. Uh, loot box number six. We got a Poupon, a Loot, and a War Mall. Uh, I mean, this is definitely the right choice. But Wob, because I didn't give you the shot hat, do you want this loot? <laughs> I'll give you a purple loot if you want it. If you don't, I'm using the poop pump. You're running a poison bard. Sounds kind of good. Go mall? Are you insane? Who's using a war mall, dude? Ah, you don't want the loot. It's it's definitely the poop point. The potpourri. Uh. To Agi for his damage bonus. This is actually good. This is Dees. A bard would like that a lot. Um, yeah, I'm going to sell that. Sorry, dude. <laughs> I'm not giving that away. Um, let's see. Five more. Let's just let it rip, bro. I'm trying to get to the, the sick loot boxes. Rip here. Uh, Watchman, Rogue, Ness. Terrible. Bro, we're getting scammed. Templar, Top Helm, Ring of Survival. Bro, these suck. These suck. Two, le two left. Just get these out of my face. Oh, wait. Okay, apparently all you gotta do is talk shit. And then the class master feels offended and hooks you up with that nice legendary Lace Turn Shoe. Oh, dude, Lace, lace Turn Shoe or Falchion? Ooh, ooh. This isn't bad. What do you guys think? Which is better here, Lace Turn Shoe or the Falchion? The Lace Turn Shoe I might actually use, but the Falchion probably is higher. I don't know. I don't even know. Y'all think Falchion? Let me let me do a quick little, uh, some quick marketplace research. Legendary Falchion is starting at 600. Legendary Lace Turn Shoe is starting at 200. Okay. Well, enough said. Enough said, boys. You got Echo of Screams today, bro. Where's that? Where's my RNG at? Yeah, we're going Falchion here. Uh, it sucks. Well, okay, I think 47 damage is highest, at least base roll. But uh, no weapon damage and only two fizz. I mean, it's something, you know, it's at least a 600 probably. Oh, I also, also didn't even notice this is a pretty good uh, bard ring here. We're doing all right. I mean, I was talking shit, but like these aren't that bad. These aren't that bad. Cultist Hood, Felling, Top Helm. What do we get? No freaking magic damage. All right, well, we're going to get rid of the garbage. Uh, turn two is 100% double move speed, double HP. Well, I messed up, I guess. I messed up. Okay, now we have this problem where should move these items around. Guys, my sash is a mess. I'll admit it. It's not it's not looking too good. And part of that is I bought this third stash tab. This is at least mostly clear, but like I have loot that just takes forever to sell and I can't be asked to sit here like while doing something else and constantly like refresh the market and sell my shit. So I have now like two kit tabs and they're like thick and full and it's a problem. I got too much too many too many kits, too much loot. I mean, there are worse problems to have, I'll admit it, but. God damn it, dude. 
just go into the loot tab, bro. Just go into the loot tab. Alright. Get these back out. If anyone's wondering, I'm using uh, a rebind of the mouse wheel to make this go faster. Too much bis? I know, dude. I know. Yo, Euthyphro, I got a 1 all, 3 vigor, 6 match, max HP, occultist tunic. Mind if I give it to you for free? Um, Koza, I appreciate the offer, but I don't take gear from viewers. Um, that's a pretty decent occultist tunic, though. It's weird. Because of this change, the occultist robe is now not as good as it used to be. So if anyone missed it, this is now minus 10 move speed instead of minus 5. And so now the occultist tunic is a little bit better in comparison. I mean, not like better than this, because I still think this is a better item. But this only has minus 9 move speed. So it's actually kind of competitive. So it's interesting, dude. It's interesting. Um, Yeah, gearing changes. I, I, I was kind of building kits and like now I'm using adventure tunics, which is kind of annoying because this shit is used by like every single freaking class. And I like my my drip like this is the cool warlock drip. This is like some rags, bro. I don't want, want to wear like a freaking burlap sack. I want to wear warlock drip, but now burlap sack is faster. So we do what we do, man. Yeah, sad. Oh, wait, I did see on the wiki. The mystic vestments was not minus 10. Is that true? Bro, how is this not a robe? I scammed myself, bro. I bought a bunch of rags instead of a mystic vest. This is totally a robe, dude. Because they added magic resist to all robes and this got magic resist. Dude. Man, now I'm going to be looking like a freaking bum. I'm looking like a bum in the dungeon instead of wearing some sick ass robes. All right. Well, it's time, boys. It's time. I, I've been I've been chatting. I've been yapping. I've been bitching. I'm doing all this stuff. But really, what it's come down to is this right here. What it's come down to is pulling the multi-classing loot boxes. Because if we get the Biss, if we get the Exodia freaking magical healing setup, I'm going to be so happy. If we get freaking spell memory one and two in every single pool, I will not be surprised. But uh, I will be very upset. <laughs> I will still be very upset. All right, boys, this is it. This is freaking it. Should I do anything for good luck? I'm going to sell. Uh, no, I can't even drink potions. I can't do shit. I'm just going in. I'm going in. Just shave top. Please, please, Mr. Cleric, bless me. Bless me with overhealing right here. Okay, we got freaking Locust Swarm. Okay, this is, has some RP value, I'll admit. The RP value of Locust Swarm on a Warlock is not lost on me. We have Holy Strike, which is probably what I'm going to take, and then Holy Light. I mean, if I was doing some group play... Wait, is the lore streaming right now? If he is... If he is, I'm taking Holy Light. But I'm pretty sure I'm taking Holy Strike. Because the lore said he wants to play some duos at some point. And I don't know if that's going to be... I don't know when that's going to be. But it would be kind of cool to run 10 spell with the homie and hook him up with some heals. But no, we're going Holy Strike because it's probably going to be a solo stream here. 10 spell potential for Holy Light? Yeah, that's what I'm saying, dude. Because the 10 spell, you don't even need like most of the shit on your second spell wheel. This would be way better. But uh, I might surprise some people with some Holy Strikes. I feel like if I Holy Strike somebody and then just pain them a bunch of times, this would actually slap, kind of. But anyway. Uh, we're going Holy Strike. We're going Holy Strike. Okay. One of six down the drain. It's okay, though, because I'm feeling lucky. I'm feeling real lucky, boys. I'm feeling real lucky. Because this one has the Biss. Watch. Requiem. Divine Protection and Brewmaster. Well, that is not exactly what I was hoping for. Uh, these suck, boys. These suck. Uh, like, I guess it's Divine Protection. Divine pr Protection is just kind of good. There's literally no point at all to taking the booze. Besides, again, RPing. And I do respect the RP uh, the RP plays, but it is not really 
not really the build that I'm looking to run right now. It's it has to be divine protection, even though I'd never see myself running this shit ever. Because I'm a caster main. Uh whatever, bro. Whatever. Hi drunk. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Oh, yeah. Can you reroll? I didn't even check. Okay. It is only 500 still, which is good. Oh, yeah. So we get two shots at this. Okay. Easy. See, I got four shots and then six more if we mess up. Multi-class just... Oh, wait. Does anybody know if they fixed the uh, the thing where you can, like, open your loot box and then reroll before you select and then you get a free token, basically? Because that would be huge info. Because if I got, uh, like, a bunch of shitty stuff and then the last one I got something good, I could reroll. Do I know if Perseverance reduces the cost of spells? Probably not, but uh, someone... Didn't somebody say they had it? In chat? Maybe. If anybody has it, let me know. Um, Multi-class just feels rough. You didn't even know how to handle a fight. You're a new player. How does shit doesn't make sense anymore? Well, I think we're all going to be in the same boat on that. I think a lot of fights are going to be determined by just... Did you guess right or how cautious you were? And I'm not exactly the most cautious player, so we may take a few L's today. We will see. Okay. Four pools remaining, boys. Four pools remaining. So far, we have complete garbage. Complete and utter garbage. But this one is the one, boys. This one is the one. Okay. Protection from evil. This is cool. I like this. Uh, it's not exactly something I want with this build, but I think this might reduce the cooldown of Dark Reflection. If it does, potentially OP combo. Potentially OP combo, especially for Source when it scales it too. But I don't actually know if it does. There's no, there's not even a question. It's definitely PFE here. We'll see. I, I'm cooking up some, some stuff with this. Uh, but that's probably for a different build. Okay. So far, mostly shafted. Just a little bit not shafted. And we got three three more chances. I still haven't seen either of the healing stuff. PFE does reduce cooldown of Dark Reflection 100%. Oh, shit, baby. So, Dark Reflection, Phantomize, Dark Reflection again. You curse somebody one time, they're dead. Pretty much. <laughs> Sounds awesome. I want to try a Thorns build. I want to try to get some wizard stuff on here. But anyway, uh, we're, we're getting distracted because this one has overhealing right here. What is this? Let's go, baby. Let's go. It's a go. Magic healing. Freaking Exodia right here. This is what this is. I, I don't even give a shit about advanced healer because I think this is more broken. I think. This should be basically just 20% bonus health, right? Maybe. Uh, Yeah, I called it, dude. Easy. I'm actually clairvoyant. I'm, I'm well on my way to becoming a divine holy man already. So... I, I, like, why, why do I even look at this other stuff? Because there's no way in hell taking anything besides overhealing. All right. All right. Uh, I have two more to go. It would be cool to get advanced healer. But I don't actually care that much because Warlock has so many good perks that I don't know what I would drop. Like, right now, I'm dropping anti-magic for something. There's no freaking way I'm dropping Dark Reflection. That just will not happen. I refuse. If I drop Vampirism for advanced healer, I'm not even sure that's, like, a healing increase. Like, maybe? Maybe it would be? I don't know. So, I'm pretty sure I can only run Advanced Healer or uh, Overhealing. So, we pretty much already have it. We already have it. Where the hell is this thing? Uh, so, what am I hoping for here? I could get a spell. Like, what would be the coolest Cleric spell? I think it'd be kind of sick to run Double Shield. So, I'm, like, both using Protection and... Uh, Eldritch Shield, that'd be kind of cool. Also for 10 spell and for team support. Um, I don't know, let's just see. The game will decide. Okay. Holy Aura. Perseverance. Okay, we can test... Oh shit, lesser heal though. We can test Perseverance. Um, no, shields don't stack, but... You know, sometimes you're fighting a wizard, sometimes you're fighting a ranger. But yeah, okay, so I can test the Perseverance thing to see if this stops my my cursed self-damage. Which, there's like no way it does, but you never know, dude. What if this also stopped Power of Sacrifice damage? Because that's, that's a different thing. It doesn't, doggo daddy. You've tried it? 
Yo, Doggo, did you test it on uh, on Power of Sacrifice also? Okay, everybody says it doesn't. How does everybody know, dude? How does everybody know? I don't know. It reduces damage to one from sac? Or are you talking about for curses? You are, Okay, Doggo Daddy, you tried it on test server. Okay. You're testing it right now. Well, does that mean, does that mean it's lesser heal here? Because lesser... I, I'm going to have a lot of magical healing on my gear. So I could just, like, pop this real quick to heal myself up. Is... Okay, what about demon form? Does this work on demon form health degeneration? Degen or whatever? Because that would also be kind of cool. Protection from evil reduces dark reflection cooldown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I know. Why well, I, I suspected it did. All right, we're going. We're going. Uh, lesser heal. Oh, it does work for demon form. Oh. Uh, regardless, I think we're going lesser lesser heal anyway. Perseverance is kind of interesting, but I need some spells, right? Besides, we're just gonna get perseverance again, uh, right here. Okay, we didn't. We got cleanse. We got Bless. We got Blunt Weapon Mastery. Is a Staff a Blunt Weapon? Is this potential Bonk potential here? It works with Bloodstained. 3 Strength, 3 Agi, 3 Will. So this gives me 1% movement speed? That seems like crap. Uh, cleanse seems like even more crap. But I sure as shit don't really see myself using Bless. So we basically just got shafted. I think we just got shafted. But we're taking bless, I guess. Staff is technically blunt, but it's pointless because you're scaling magic damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree. I agree. We're blessing out here. We're blessing ourselves or the boys. Cleanse would be good for bossing. It doesn't even work on any boss stuff, though, I feel like. Doesn't it not work on Blitch, Lich anymore? Am I re-rolling? Hell no, dude. We're trying advanced healer. Matter of fact, I'm just going to throw it on right now because I know I'm going to forget. What sucks, though, is I have to drop anti-magic. And anti-magic is actually pretty nice. Or sorry, overhealing. This is what we got. So if the target's health is at full health, additional healing can be done by 20% of the target's max HP. So I basically just get 20% HP. I mean, this is like kind of good, but it's really not. It's like basically robust, but worse. Drop Dark Reflection. No. No, dude. No. Dark Reflection is the most OP perk in the entire game. I'm not dro dropping Dark Reflection. Ain't no way. Pashi said it doesn't work with curses. You talking about the... This thing? Wait. Well, I guess I don't have it. Perseverance. <clears throat> Drop Shadow Touch. A Shadow Touch is not on, dude. Uh, we're, we have a, a TM set up here. We have a magical healing set up. So, we're, we're in business, basically. I can now choose, or I can now kit up. It's funny that I only really wanted one perk, and I'm still happy with this. Wait, overheal doesn't work with curses? You're shitting me. Why not? Freaking better, dude. It was working on the test server, I'm pretty sure. Because I talked to somebody in-game who had it. I didn't have it, but I talked to somebody who did and said it was good. Okay, so I have a couple kits set up here. Okay, yeah, it was, a lot of people say it does work. One person says it doesn't. We're going to trust the majority. I mean, regardless, I'll find out in a second. Even if I'm down one perk, it's not like the end of the world for one game. Over here works when you cast it. Takes from HP, not shields. So you need to get full HP to refresh the shield. Oh, I see what you're saying. I mean, that's fair. That's that's fine. All right, here we go, baby. Here we go. Uh, I have a couple kits set up. I have like a pretty good kit, like high high budget kit, mid to high budget kit, and a mid budget kit here. Because if we're warlock, we can't really run the uh, the low budget all that easily, regardless. So we're gonna kit up in some. Mid-budget magical healing. I hate this item, but I'm using it. Um, 
the the freaking robe nerf is so annoying because I, I really don't want to wear these rags, but we we are, are like an anti-drip build right here. Like, look at how stupid I look. I go from looking like a freaking boss, looking like a piece of freaking like beggar, beggar on the side of the road, dude. Why I hate? Because it's a it's rags, dude. I look like a freaking I look like a bum. I'm a hobo. Not the raw hides. The raw hides also look kind of bad. <laughs> I mean, these don't look any better, though. <laughs> uh, the peasant peasant build, dude. Peasant warlock build. Alright. Um, I don't think I really need to do much else. I mean, I guess I could take this thing. I'll save that for a different kit. Because this is the, the low-budget one here. Mystic Gloves or Biss? Uh, I mean, they're Ds, but the ones with knowledge are, can be kind of expensive. And it's kind of hard to get knowledge these days. Oh, it's hard to get knowledge because... Loose trousers are the best pants in the game because of the movement speed changes, and it's not even close. I think loose trousers need a nerf. I think these should be minus five move speed, and they'll still be really, really good in solos. I think these are, like, almost mandatory. I think they're so good. Um, in fact, like, even, the, even though these have three agility on them, these are mid. These are mid, dude. Uh, cool. What else do I need? I need bandages, and I'm good to go. Take one bandage. Oh, I already have already have lockpicks. Cloak nerfs hurt. No more free plus five knowledge. Oh, that was a while ago though. Yeah. <laughs> I agree. Uh so this kit, we have I think, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine additional. I didn't I don't have additional on my cloak because I was really struggling for knowledge and HP, and I didn't want to spend too much. You're running Vampirism over Advanced Healer? Oh, I just got shafted, bro. I just didn't get Advanced Healer. I need to hit the gym, dude. I need to hit the level the level grinder and uh, get some get some levels here. Um, okay, the question is, do I run some weird cheeky cleric spell as my fifth spell? Because when you're running Hydra, or when you're running uh, Magic Healing Warlock, you have to run these three, pretty much. And Flamewalker is an obvious one as well. And... I could run Lesser Heal... I could run Bless. I could run Holy Strike. Yeah, was Holy Strike dumb? Is this a, a dumb move? I think it'd be kind of funny, dude. <sighs> Lesser Heal in the Clutch also sounds kind of good. Why additional? You're talking about additional magic? Uh, it's just for the shit I had laying around. Lesser Heal is a quicker Hydrain? I guess so. Yeah, I did get Perseverance. But the problem is Warlock has so many freaking good perks, I can't just throw it on. Or wait, did I get Perseverance? No, I got Protection from Evil. <clears throat> when you level up Wizard, you could switch something for Flamewalk or for something like Chain. The thing is, Flamewalk is just so good for keeping people off of you. And Wizards now, I think, are going to get shit on a little bit in, uh, in GC because everyone's going to have Sprint. <laughs> Earthquake Hydra? Oh, I never thought about that. That sounds kind of fun. That might be okay. Got to keep the magic shield. Well, the thing is, you can just bring these. Actually, speaking of, I should just bring these. And, like, this just gives me more health than an Elder Shield would. Wait. Right? Because this gives me 15 health, but I have a shit ton of magic healing and vampirism. So the 20 health shield is like jack, or 25 damage shield is not going to be as much healing as this. So I'm pretty sure this is just good. You're a whiz using sprint? <laughs> Bro, I'm about to get wrecked. I, I haven't really played much multi-classing. I played test server a little bit, but I honestly didn't enjoy it that much. I played that one stream and that was pretty much it. Um. Okay. I never use my invis pot, so I don't feel the need to take this either. Am I good to go? What am I forgetting, boys? Uh, there's always something. We get this set up here. A bandage. My single-use emergency bandage. Uh, I think I'm just good to go. Dark Reflection plus PFE Wizard Ice Shield Perseverance. Yeah, with uh, Active Shield or whatever. Arcane Shield, the, the Q ability. That shit seems good. Because both of those do reflect damage. It should be insane amounts of damage. <clears throat> Alright, we're just going in. We're going in, boys. 
in the old GC, dude. Welcome to the Goblin Caves. Yo can help you cast Hydra if your life is low. Oh, that's true. Yeah, you can... Wait, you only get three of them. I didn't realize that. Oh, my knowledge is so bad. You can... Uh, uh, use this instead of your bandage if you ever get too low. Oh, I can't let them know I have it. I haven't warmed up today yet. So we're just going in. I just did some trading earlier and that's it. Why the rags over the occultist tunic, somebody asked, or the occultist robe? Because these have better move speed. Even though my move speed is kind of garbage. And everybody's gonna have sprint. No way, bro. Oh, okay. Respect. This guy's kind of juicing. Wait, true fizz. What the heck is this guy doing? Blood packed. Overhealing. Wait. With this. What? Was that me or was that him? No, it was blood packed. Blood packed overhealing. What the hell is he doing? Is he going to drink a potion first? What the heck is what the heck is that? Really, really confused. Bring a campfire. Oh, shit. You're right. You're right. You're right. I'm not used to the cleric life, bro. Not used to the cleric life. I hate this one. Alright, we're over here. Shit. That helped already. The thing is though, like, my overhealing in this kit, it's not even, uh, not even that much because my health is so low. <laughs> like, I've had more health than this on a, on a regular kit. I guess it helps me uh, not be so squishy. Mm, no, thank you. Guys, hot take. I miss plus two all. <laughs> I, was, I was talking to, uh, to ModX the other day. In his stream, he's like, oh, shocker, the warlock misses plus two all. But man, it was so nice for, like, knowledge and movement speed and, like, just the speed of the game. I understand why I got removed, but I liked it. I liked it. Actually, this room over here is going to be insane for overhealing because all those mobs in the cages... Should be able to get me a bunch of, uh, bunch of free overhealing. Kind of bad. People like these. Too true. Got some pimp gloves with two true fizz. Probably not. Probably not. It's a very hot take. Plus to all is carcinogenic for the game. Insurmountable gear gap equals people get discouraged. Oh, there's a dude. It's a barb. <sighs> well, there's no tea bag in here, bro. Miss. I broke the door. Guy. I don't think he knows what he's doing. That sucks. Okay, yeah, like, look at my health bar. What's going on with my health bar? That's so weird. Oh, he's got luck, dude. He's got a luck set on. What the hell is this guy doing? What? Respect, I guess. Is this stuff, uh... What the... Is this stuff worth... Taking to sell? Do people buy luck shit? Do 
Interesting. Yeah, that guy was far, far too slow to ever... to ever possibly kill a warlock. Unfortunate, dude. I don't think I'm taking any of this crap, though. Luck is cheap now. What's funny is you can get more luck on gear. They're like, we reduce the power of rolls, except for luck. They didn't say, but the luck, luck power got increased. Wait, he could have he could have had luck right there, dude. Spellbook? Not really. At least turn shoot. Alright, all this stuff kind of sucks. Well, I appreciate him breaking all the boxes for me. It's very nice of him. I took this vi so I could bust the boxes. Luck is for the memers. I mean, I do appreciate a good meme. Don't get me wrong. And I do really like dumb luck stuff like the stupid ass royal coffin. Even though it's bad. Wait, okay, was I not a full health this whole time? Oh, a guy. Shit. Where'd you come from, dude? Oh, he's taking some risks. Where's he going? got the goblin mage on him dude nah i don't mess with that that's that's where i draw the line all right homie backed out For sure that he actually backed out. He could have hid right here. All right, let's kill this. Also, the worst part of this last patch is that the Chris Dagger was nerfed, boys. Chris Dagger was nerfed. I understand why. I mean, truly, it was too OP. Truly. Please, Hydra. Do not fight the spiders, bro. I go up there now. It's annoying. This guy, I have a feeling he's not going to want to actually fight me. Uh, is that him? somebody else interesting interesting dude you guys see that casting bug right there I think spiders bro all right where are we at um okay where would that guy have gone if he went up north he could come from, like, over here. It's not super likely, but... Please. Please, Mr. Mage. Go, go away. Can we do trios at some point again? Yeah, absolutely. All of us, I think, want to do it again. We, uh, I think we all had a great time. I mean, it's hard to argue with the results as well. I know the Lord was asking about, or was, was talking about duos recently as well. Okay, wait, this is open now. Where's my boy at? Ain't no way he went down here. He probably just came back in. I want to get landmined. Uh, I'm going to sack this guy and go back in. Use advanced healer as much as possible or whatever. Overhealing. Ever build for demon form? I've done it before. It kinda is not that good right now though. I don't find it very good. Holy shit. <laughs> Alright. Did he have cutthroat? No, he couldn't have.
Where's the homie at? Sprint road, baby. somebody. Man, I get, my health is so low on this kit. Feels bad. This guy undoubtedly has sprint as well, so I gotta have to be very careful when, when I open this door. Sprint at my face. It's a good sign. See over there. Got that door open. Okay, he's here. He's playing very cautiously. My knowledge is bad. So I'm not sure if this is a ranger or a fighter. I guess does it even matter these days? He's gonna camp static, that's my guess. Uh what? Maybe he just took static? Wait. What am I hearing? He's in there, I think. There's my rogue. Look at that, bro. Chill, bro. Nah. We got a sniper in our hands. I don't like snipers, boys. Don't do it. I have to go murder that guy. Mage just cast it, I think that's what that was. Don't snipe, dude, don't snipe. I gotta turn VoIP off also. Also, like, does he not want to fight? I'm trying to fight. Fight me, bro, fight me. Dude, fight me! Why not? Overhealing is insane? Yeah. <laughs> Seems kind of good. Seems kind of good. Bro, even, it even works with potions. Not that that's a ton of healing, but it's something. Like, look at this, bro. I curse up the spider, and I just get on my way, and suddenly I got 20% increased HP. Not bad, dude. I guess we'll head towards static. Bro, my Hydra combo. I, I need way more max HP. I guess it covers up for how weak this uh, this gear setup is, but I do not like running magic healing with 100 HP. That's for sure. Okay, got something going on here. Static. Wait, they changed this room. This room is different. 
is like way more claustrophobic. That's weird. Oh, that's a nightmare bola, dude. Please go away. Nice 14 FPS. <laughs> yeah, well, that's the price we pay for an OP ability. Flame walk everywhere, bro. Oh, this probably looks like shit on stream too, huh? Because of the uh, the bit rate. It looks fine for me. Like, I'm not getting bad FPS, but I'm sure the stream looks like shit. Unfortunate. <laughs> too many particle effects. What's up, Lance? How you doing, bro? We hit, we hit the stuff. The thing. I don't know why I really want to use the portal instead of just the static. Bull is dead, right? Yeah, it must be. Unlucky. Whatever. We're just getting out of here. Whew. You only see orange. <laughs> yeah, well. <laughs> it is what it is. Koto loves the content. Thanks, bro. How's it going? You lost no quality with the flame rock? Oh, that's good. I was worried. Because, like, the way, like, encoding works, the... The videos, the recording can be higher quality than the, than the the than the stream, and it always upsets me that the stream doesn't look as good. But I'm glad you guys don't mind. <clears throat> GG, isn't this build better on cleric because of base stats? Uh, now there is an interesting thought using like Curse of Pain and all that stuff. Well, the thing is, I really like. Like, you'd have to get a lot of stuff. Like, I, I like every single one of these abilities. And in order to run magic healing with curses, you'd probably want both of these. I mean, you don't necessarily need Hydra, but you probably would want Hydra. But, yeah, interesting. Advanced Healer's probably best if you don't want to run Occultus Hood or Mystic Loves. Yeah, true. True. Um, but this is the budget build. I have... I mean, I have uh, all, the, all that stuff. I mean... You don't you don't actually need that much magic healing. You can you can run like eleven and it's just fine. In fact, I, I don't actually like going for more than eleven, to be honest. Uh but yeah, dude, okay. Nice first run. We killed a barb who had no idea what he was doing. Or at the very least, his build was super scuffed. And we had a rogue that was a chicken and just ran away. So if you're in stream, bro, you're a chicken. I'm calling you out. I'm calling you out. <clears throat> Uh, some decent gloves. That's not too bad. Overall, seems decent. Overall, it'll be much better on a better setup than this one. I I, I know for sure. Ever try MH in normals? Um, I've done MH in normal ice caves where I was trying to like 1v2 and it was pretty good. <clears throat> Honestly, in normals, it's fine. Like people have such low damage, and as long as you can outrun them, you're pretty much you're pretty much chilling. It's not too bad. I like it. You level one thirty? Jesus, dude. No, no, no. I had six learning points, and I'm only level eighty. So something's up with you, dude. Actually, wait. How did I have six learning points? Uh, don't ask questions, bro. I I don't want the answer. I just I'm just gonna accept that I have a lot of. Uh, <laughs> A lot of learning points. I'm, from what I understood, that wouldn't have been six, but it is what it is. <clears throat> All right, we need to get back in here. Uh, what did I have before? I never actually used my lesser heal. I guess I didn't really need to. But, oh, lockpicks, I guess. I'll just bring one. All right, dude, proof of concept. I feel so slow, though. Like, this sucks. I hate this. This is not nice. And this is with the freaking rags, too, for the speed. Unlucky. Unlucky, dude. All right, bro. I got to change regent because that dude. <clears throat> Gamma, what's going on, dude? What's going on, Gamma? Bard main, you got sprint yet? <clears throat> Can I do a melee build with Ignite, uh, Dark Touch, Bloodstained Blade, and BOC? Uh, I did that already on the test server. 
and it was mediocre. It was mediocre. It's just better to, to get all that stuff on Wizard, I think. Need advanced healer and shadow mask. Yeah, that's true. Matter of fact, I'm not even sure. I'm not even sure this thing is uh, worth using at all. Though I'm pretty sure it has two agility on it, so it's not even that bad. Do I even need the four additional? Because I think I have nine on this kit anyway. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I probably don't even really need that. Ew, this is a gross spawn. I don't like this spawn at all. Get me in here. All right, we're going in, boys. Basically the same exact setup as last time off the bat. He knows. I swear they know the timing. <clears throat> hmm. I heard somebody over there. There might be somebody upstairs already. The place that I spawned is definitely not impossible. So I should be on my toes. You know what's weird? Mobs don't seem to be able to aggro, through, aggro you through this thing, but they can aggro, aggro you through like a, a solid door. Gamma, dude, you did turn your back on the cloth, bro. Do you believe all the all the naysaying firebox is done? That cleric is totally garbage now. It's weird to me to think that a class that everybody wants their stuff could be totally garbage. Wait, is that good? Six max HP. Doesn't seem bad anyway. Yeah, firebox made this post today, completely doom and glooming about how bad cleric is now after. Uh, Divine Protection and uh, Smite nerf. And like, sure, like the two main abilities getting nerfed does sound kind of bad. But, but like, what? Like, if it was nerfed because all these other classes won it, what does that say? Like, does that say the Cleric has really good abilities? I don't know, dude. I don't know. Oh, sick. Lantern? Came across a barb with rage and sprint. Yeah, yeah. I've seen I've seen that on the test server. That was only a matter of time. I respect it. The need for speed. Alright, so what is pre-buffing to go into a room look like these days? Okay, somebody was in here. Looks like casting this shit. Getting my overheal up. Doing the jump back flame walk. Probably should have drank a pot. Also should have gone in on the other side. Okay, it's a cleric. This is interesting. He's got rage! <laughs> Don't you have heals? Why are you potting? Bro, I, he's immortal. He's freaking immortal. Like, what? Oh, 
Same, bro. Same. That doesn't do anything, dude. How is he alive? How is he alive, bro? Jesus. Excuse me? Excuse me, dude? I have a lot of damage. Okay, I don't have that much damage, but I'm doing 11, 11, or wait, 27 damage, Curse of Pains? That's not bad. Holy shit! I feel like he must, yeah, I think you guys are right. I think he must have Iron Will. There's no way he's, he's living that long without that, without Iron Will or something. Like, what the hell was that? I need more true. I feel like we're in a true damage meta again. It was additional for a while, but I've seen all I need to see, bro. Like, what? I, that, my mind is blown. I got to see what he's wearing, bro. Watch him be in like full base. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, he, he's a marketed. Okay, boys. Okay. Okay. Yep. Is this even good? No. That's really good. That's pretty good. Stitched. I mean, his kit's like, okay. It's not that good. Hound skull? I mean, I don't know, man. Uh, something, something is up, dude. <laughs> something is up. <laughs> oh, that was fun, though. It was only fun because he was really slow. Like, imagine like I was fast. Like, if he had rage or a uh, sprint instead of rage, that would have been better. He probably should have taken like chest off or something. I don't know. I don't know what he should have done. Man, that was something else. <laughs> that was something else. Why does it? Wait, what? Oh. I can just hold this now. Can I smack with it? Oh, I'll bet. This is sick. I mean, I don't know what I'm going to do this or use this for, but I'm happy about that. Let's go. <laughs> oh, boy. I don't think I want any of this other stuff. Are these any good? I mean, these, they seem decent for a cleric, but I don't think... Oh, loot can break boxes? Is it better than the pickaxe? Hold it for now. Why not? Also, wait, is this book? No, it doesn't have healing on it. Wait, hold on, that's kind of good. I'll take this too, somehow. I've also never once used stitch turn shoes. It's a balanced shit show, <laughs> yeah. I mean, oh, this is like the same. Uh, I don't know that shit. Get, the, get this out of my inventory. Looks gross. I don't I don't want the boxes. I'm just gonna bang this guy's stuff, even though this stuff's kinda weird. Only counter these magic healing is fire mastery demon lock. I don't think so. I think a wizard with high damage. Oh, I really want to get Iron Will. I was trying to level my Bard yesterday, and, or my, not my Bard, my Barb. Uh, but then the rollback thing was announced, so I like didn't actually get the levels. But I think a Magic Immune Warlock would be fun. Damn, okay, I didn't actually want to wake the Skelly up. It's okay though. You can get around Slayer with Demon Armor. Okay, what's going on up there? What's that about? Hmm. 
Hmm. You know, so BOC someone with EQ. What? You're joking. What? How did, how did you even find that out? Like, first off, who the heck is running BOC and Earthquake? What the heck? That was weird. I really need to fix that spell memory, uh, spell memory warlock bug. It actually drives me insane. Alright, the static did just open. Uh, this isn't even cleared. I'm just going static. You bank this, this, uh, cleric stuff. Not too bad. Oh, the static? You can't go in as far anymore. That's weird. There's only one other guy. And then there's... What? This much of the round gone? Weird. Found some nice stuff for himself. Okay. Uh... Cool. I don't know. I don't actually know if these this stuff sells, but... Maybe in the Magic Resist, in the Iron Will multi-classing era, the Dark Leathers will be a little better. Also, I feel like this, this cloak has no stats. What's the cheapest one? Was this actually a good pickup? I mean, 400 gold? It's something. It's shiny. Shots on, thoughts on Overheal so far. I mean, it's good. It's definitely good. Uh, it definitely didn't do shit against that cleric because of protection from evil. PFE makes it so that your curses don't last for, like, any time at all on him. So, that kind of sucks. But, in general, like, it's really, really nice, if nothing else, than to, like, pre-buff. So, you, like, pre-buff using your overheal on a hydra or something before you go into a room and you just suddenly have more HP. Like, it's, it's nice. I like it. It even works with, uh, what do you call it? It works with potions. So you can just chug a pot and like start healing up. It's kind of sick. It's actually really sick. Well, that's where my protection pots went. Alrighty. Yeah, the, the main thing I'm not liking right now is just my movement speed. <laughs> my movement speed is atrocious. To second wind on Barb, heal for like 80 HP. Yeah, it would. It does heal for a lot. Because it's based on your max HP. <clears throat> um, So far, so good. Okay, so what are the weird things we've run into so far? We saw a freaking rogue with sprint. That's not that weird. It's probably going to be one of the metas, I would assume. But I don't know. He didn't really try that hard to, to kill me. I think he just ran away. And then we saw a cleric who, I don't know if he was multi-classing or what, but he had infinite magic res. But you went on the perks. The only perk I got is overhealing, but I also have lesser heal. Oh, lesser heal was sick versus that cleric, though. Because normally when you fight a cleric, your, your health goes down over time. Because, again, you can't really heal off of them because of protection from evil. But I was able to just top myself off in an instant with that. That was nice. That was super nice. I, I actually really liked lesser heal there. <clears throat> I think we're good to go. I think we're going back in. This isn't doing a single thing. <clears throat> yeah, also it healed like way, way more. How did it heal so much? It healed like 70 HP, I feel like, or 60 HP. Something was up with that. I don't know how it healed me that much. <clears throat> uh, we're just, yeah, we're good. We're good. Cleric Rage. Oh, true, true. He had Rage. I forgot. I forgot. I don't know who who's ever going to catch. Not me. And also, what's with these teabaggers in the lobbies, huh? Why we have, why we have teabaggers these days? Was it just because he saw Warlock and he got afraid? Oh, this guy looks fast. Wait, is this that same dude? What the hell is this? Oh, my friend! You've got some nice stuff for me, brother. Okay. Savage War Rage? How fast are you? Wait, is this a ranger? No, a barb with a longbow. And a rondell buckler. <laughs> what is even happening, dude? What's happening? 
<laughs> I thought for sure that was a, a fighter or a ranger. I want his stuff, dude. I don't have any demon stuff. I'm trying to get some demon clads. We've got a mission, boys. We've got a mission. Oh, I, sh I didn't look at his movement speed, but it can't be that high. Meme Barb. Yeah, he, he wants to play the dagger fighter, but for some reason he's playing Barb. Not sure why. Yeah, um, vampirism does work on all types of healing, so I'm sure it works on uh, lesser heal too, but still, 20% of 15 is like 3 or something. So, like, <laughs> I don't know. Wouldn't, still wouldn't think it would make it crazy like that. I'll have to look at it again. Uh, this kit also doesn't have very much max HP. It's only 108. This is a mid kit. Come on, Mr. Goblin, don't do this. Don't be annoying, please. Alright, if I was a weird-ass barb, where would I be? Mid, I guess? MS was 289? Okay. So even with rage, she's gonna have a hard time catching me. Wait. I don't know what I thought I heard. Oh, someone is over there. Sure he's magic damage though. <sighs> Alright, I mean the lesser heal is freaking insane, boys. Absolutely insane. Like, no need to reset when you have lesser heal. Oh, I gotta start bringing camps, I forgot. And you can probably just sit for lesser heal, yeah? How, how is it doing so much healing, bro? Uh, something is up. Uh, wait, this guy didn't have as much damage as I thought he did. Did he come in from over there? Is there someone else in here now? Like, this guy's build is weird. That doesn't look good. I really wanted in Vizpots. He's got so much knowledge. His damage bonus? I mean, maybe. I don't want that stuff. I have 107 health. Yeah, it's probably just because my health is so low. I don't really want to kill all the mobs up top here. Because. Wait. Wait, hold on. Somebody killed mobs over there. Did someone else come in here? I feel like it was probably this guy. Okay, how how fast does this come back? I have a lot of knowledge. A decent amount anyway. Okay, not too bad. What perks did I get? Just this. Just this. But I also got lesser heal, and lesser heal is OP, it seems. Like, if I thought I had a lot of sustain before, sweet Jesus. Okay, and that also comes back super fast. <laughs> Bro, this combo is insane. Alright, I still need to find that barb. Does he look like a troll killer to you guys? It's a decent shield. I never sell shields though. Oh, ew. 
I guess we can see what's up over there. Why not? Right, you guys know how in the last patch, not like this most recent one, but the one before, they said something about the sound change, like the footstep change was was adjusted. Does anyone know like how it actually was adjusted? Okay, somebody was in here. To be closer to hear him okay i mean advanced healers bis or if you're talking about my gear my gear is mid but overhealing seems better than advanced healer to me in truth oh what the hell Where did he go? Oh, he went in troll room? <clears throat> now I'm one lesser heal away from being full HP. That's crazy, bro. Hurting now. Oh shit. <laughs> Not gonna lie, this is bullshit. What I'm doing to this guy. Yeah, that was bullshit. Uh, there's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. I, uh, what was he supposed to do? Lesser is bis, boys. Lesser is like so bis, it's not even funny. He hit me so many times and it just didn't even matter. That's kind of good. Does he have protections for me? Yes, he does. These are probably worth taking still. His power, two additional, meh. One all padded. It's better than this, probably. I don't really know, though. He's got a camp for me. I'm just going to rip that right away. Wait. Holy shit, dude. I, I feel weird about this. <laughs> Damn. Needed to keep going after your Phantomize? I mean, his movement speed was just too low for that. He, he was never going to catch me, and I'm not even that fast. Why didn't he use Magic Prot? True, he could use Magic Prot. He could have brought a bow. I mean, all things considered, he played it okay. It's just... I have literally infinite sustain. I mean, okay, I was out of sustain after that, but I have a lot of sustain. That comes back pretty fast. Everything good here?
I mean, I assume he had the best shit on him. Okay, uh, some of the stuff is probably worth dropping for treasure. Uh, I think this is probably good. One additional. I don't really know the price of these riveteds. I hardly ever sell these, these, these anymore. I don't usually pick them up. Maybe I can drop some meds. Oh, I can definitely drop some meds. Mm, I'll drop this too. If I have lesser, I like don't even really need bandages. Question is, fizz power cap or riveted with one additional? Uh, I don't know. So I'll take these. Oh, check door. Good call. Why is it so freaking dark? Is there a light missing? What is this? No, okay. Dude. Alright, well we found the build, boys. We hit Exodia. Because this kid isn't even good, remember that. This kid is mid. If I had a better kid on, it would be even more even more crazy. Double check troll. Here's somebody, I think. Maybe I hear, I'm hearing goblins. Um, I am sad about that barb, but I have a lot of stuff. I think I'm just gonna extract. Let's see if he's still in the game. Um, is it this guy? Oh, he's just camping static anyway, so I was never gonna get him. Why is he playing like such a freaking chicken, bro? You have insane stuff. Also, he's got a resourcefulness build. Wait. Is that on purpose? Wait, they had magical healing also. Why did he have magical healing? Weird. Rip the famine? Wait, why rip the famine? That we I mean, I sold the famine. I did consider like just giving it to the lore and telling him, like, dude, you should run a build with this. But we we just sold it. <clears throat> Okay. Oh, maybe he was potion chugging. Maybe that's what he was doing. Though I didn't really look at his his stuff that much. All right. Well, we got a problems, boys. The, the kit tab is or the uh, the loot tab is filling up already. Probably gonna have to sell some stuff. Um, nice run though. <laughs> we just learned. We just learned the uh, the lesser heal, man. We learned the truth. Of how good the lesser heal is. <laughs> I'm like beyond convinced that it's Biss now. Uh, also, I, I only have 29 knowledge. The higher my knowledge, the, the, mo the more beneficial it is because I can quick cast it. Yeah, if you guys are wondering about the kit, I'm not sure I actually went over it, but it's basically just... I don't even have additional on all my stuff. This is pretty good. Most of the stuff costs like 250 or less. Uh, I think this cost like 400 and something else costs 400. This was only 250. This was only 250. This was only 250. These were just in my stash. Some I thought something else cost. Oh, maybe the cape was like 300 or something. I don't know. But yeah, this is like very, very mid. The perks am I using? This. Right here. Oh, my face cam is on the way. Um, This. Vampirism, Dark Reflection, Overhealing, TM. So basically you just switch out uh, anti-magic for overhealing. At least that's how I'm running it. The neck is bis. Talking about this one? Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, this thing? Yeah, but it was only 250, and there was another one on the market, the exact same for 250 as well. <clears throat> Why overhealing? Because I'm a magical healing build, dude. Because I basically just get 20% max HP. It's really, really good. <clears throat> okay, uh, let's let's go again. Actually, I kind of have to sell some stuff. Unfortunately, we'll throw on some tunes for the for the occasion. Uh, it'd be nice to have stuff that sells fast. So I guess I'll sell stuff like the padded. One fifty, maybe it wasn't worth picking up.
Your overhealing usually runs out by the time you get into melee. Uh, it's not necessarily melee though. It's like for the guy crossbowing me and stuff. Like, I think it's good. I think it's real good. Advanced healer probably better than overheal with lower gear. Potentially. <clears throat> with low gear, yeah. Because also your knowledge is really bad when you have low gear. And that makes it so that your... Uh... Your Hydra is like harder to actually heal off of. Oh, also guys, I don't know if you saw this in the patch notes, but you can now search for action speed and true fizz at the same time. How crazy is that? Like searching the market is, wait, what? Wait, where the hell did I get this? Was this off the fighter? Is this really that expensive? This is the exact same one. Holy shit. If somebody wants that, feel free. <clears throat> what about something like Staff Mastery? Well, I think I, I tried that on the test server. I think Staff Mastery going or uh, getting BOC on your wizard is better than getting Staff Mastery on your Warlock. It's not bad, but it's I don't think it's quite as good. Right, and now I can also search. Well, I guess this is probably just too true. Protection is pretty good, but don't know what you could drop for it. You're talking about the like the shield, right? Yeah, I think it's kind of cool to. I think it'd be really good in ten spell because you could play really good support with that. You could have both shields, and I don't know. I think it sounds good. Oh, this guy's champion armor. Achilles on curse. <laughs> I don't think it would work. Though there's like way more stuff you can uh, you can throw now. Like you can equip drums, I'm pretty sure, from the squire. So you can like throw a drum at somebody. Warlock didn't have any throwing weapons that he could use, but now he does because of the drum. So that's kind of cool. Bless is good. Well, yeah, it's not bad, but it's it's not good enough to take over any of the stuff that's in my wheel already. And that's why I don't want to run it. I mean, it's not it, clearly a freaking light heal is so good. Like, I, I'm never dropping that shit. Wait, this is actually kind of cracked, bro. The the loot box actually came through. That's underpriced, too. That's fine. <clears throat> Reading cloak wasn't worth picking up either with luck. Party chip, what's up, dude? What do you multi class over? Uh, just light heal and overhealing, but light heal is so broken, dude. Like, with the amount of magical healing and like vampirism and shit you get, you just like top yourself off immediately. You take a crossbow to the head early in the fight as a warlock, nope, light heal, back to full, easy. Anti-magic over Dark Reflection? Cap, dude. Dark Reflection is so broken. I will never, I will never ever run a build without Dark Reflection. In fact, if you're running a Warlock build and you're not running Dark Reflection, that's just a sign to you that your build might be fraudulent. Like, Dark Reflection is, is the most broken ability in the entire game, or most broken perk in the entire game. How is the plus five magical healing perk? Uh, I don't have it yet, so I can't say for sure, but it, it will give you... Wait, what? These are so cheap. What? Don't bards like these? Weird. Uh, yeah, it, it'll give you half a health per second. 0 0.5 HP per second on your curse healing. So be that or take that as you will. I mean, it's pretty good. That's a, that's a freaking scam. That's a really good, really good fucking test. Too agi. Wow, these are really cheap also? Why are these so cheap? Dark plate is really out of style. <clears throat> Tried plus five in test server, but it didn't work. 
Are you sure it didn't work? You sh or was it just not that good? Because, like, with, uh, with the way the new scaling works, I mean, I say new, but it's been out for kind of a while. With the way the scaling works, you, you don't get that much for magical healing. That's why I was saying I think overheal is probably better. <clears throat> but, yeah, I don't know. In, in a, like a low gear setting, I think it'd be good. And also maybe in like a super high juice setting, it might be good too. But I think in the mid, it's like mid. <laughs> There's so many good perks out there. There's so many good warlock perks. And now you're not even you're not even uh, bound to just the good warlock perks. You can get anybody's good perks. You're healing the same exact amount naked. Oh, that's weird. Well, I definitely saw people running it. They must have been not <laughs> not understanding that kind of screwing themselves over. All right. Okay. Do I even bring bandages, bro? I'm going to, but I think I'm just going to bring one because this, this lesser heal is too good. Yeah, I think we're good to go. <clears throat> Overhealing is nice with lesser heal. I mean, I'm never going to waste one of these. Oh, I didn't bring a camp. Shit. I'm never going to waste one of them early on. Oh, it's the same dude. Oh, wait, this is a windless. This is a different guy. This is actually a fighter. What the hell is going on here, bro? Is this from a quest? Or did he just get shit on? Because that is bad. <laughs> that is bad. Can't really see anybody buying that. He's not that fast, though, so I, I'm okay at fighting this guy. 98 with no weapons out. Mm, could be a problem. We'll see. What spells am I running? These ones. <clears throat> Alright. Focus up! Focus up! Ah, here we go. Maybe you just got it for a bargain? Yeah. Well, I know the, the ruby silver vestments or whatever uh, are a reward from a quest, and I sold mine, and it was like, had one knowledge or something, so it was kind of poor. And it's sold for like 50 gold or something stupid. It's stupidly low. Yeah, it's over suck time, Foxy. <laughs> uh, all right, here we go. Here we go. This, uh, this, like, shield pool is separate from the health pool reminds me of some other game, but I can't put my finger on it. There's some other game where you're managing resources like that. Oh, in PoE. In Path of Exile, sometimes your, like, energy shield is freaking high, but your health is getting low from chaos damage. Any, uh, any PoE players know what I'm talking about. It's kind of like Matt managing energy shield. Also, oh my god, sorry for the blind guys. Also, this chest now might be a pretty good warlock chest. Because a purple one uh, will still only have minus five movement speed because there's Agi on the base. I thought about buying those instead of the rags. Um, but the rags are actually pretty cheap, so I went with the rags instead. The yellow part of the health bar is called Advanced Healer. It's from a perk called Advanced, or sorry, uh, Overhealing. Basically converts any healing that goes over 100% of my health into a shield. Or, I guess, temporary health. A robe's bad now? Uh, I mean, in solos, you just need so much movement speed that I don't really want to run them. It seems like they forgot Mystic Vest, though. Like, Mystic Vest, for some reason, still only has minus 5. I didn't, I didn't realize that until I started stream where I would have bought them, because Mystic Vests are actually kind of nice. I don't mind Mystic Vests at all. The, the will ends up giving you a decent amount of damage. Really? 
wonder if uh, overheal. I mean, I feel like the overheal would block the sacrifice damage, right? Arm sacrifice. You sack yourself for an accident. XP. Okay, someone was over here. I should uh, maybe not run over there willy nilly. Wait. Oh, he's here. He's here. What the heck? Is this Achilles? Bola, dude. There's so many mobs. What the hell? Where'd he go, dude? There he is. What? This guy's got the world on him. I wonder if he hit the centipede yet. Let's hope he did. Go get him. Go get him, peed. He's coming back. This guy's a freaking barb, dude. He's a, a rogue barian, dude. Is this Demo? Guys, I'm definitely afraid of the uh, this goblin mage, by the way. I get clapped by the goblin mage on the regular, so I need to kill this guy. <laughs> Even though it's kind of good for me to have mobs around. Alright, he's back. Let's do this, bro. Don't run away. Why doesn't he have throwing knives? I'm not missing this, by the way. Oh, that hurts a lot, dude. It hurts uh, real big. Come on, Tenepi, hook me up, bro. No! Okay, so he had throwing knives the whole time and just didn't even use them. Also, oh, it is Demo, dude. It is Demo. All right, fair enough. This is a good player, guys. If you don't know who Demo is, he's uh, another YouTuber. I think he streams too, maybe. But, uh, dude, how did I miss all my curses, bro? I, I swear I have a sense. I have a sense for when I'm fighting some other creator. That just tells you how much freaking YouTube I watch. <laughs> Alright, well, GG's. The, uh, did you have back attack? How did that first attack do so much freaking damage? Oh, never mind. My build is, like, super squishy. I forgot. Okay, well, fair enough. Fair enough, fair enough. On to the next kit, boys. On to the next kit. Sadly, I haven't even gained a level yet. How much? Okay, so it's 500 per level. I do kind of miss the 50 XP test server level system. It's cool. I knew based off the way he's moving. Yeah. <laughs> I love Demo, dude. Demo is so sick. Hmm. <clears throat> Have I tried trios? It's unplayable. Are you saying since multi-classing came out? No, I haven't. Uh, it sounds wild, bro. It sounds totally wild. I'm not even sure what people would be running. Damn it, dude. Oh, man. Uh, I fought Demo one other time, and it was a stalemate. And I freaking... It was a stalemate because I had him on the ropes, and I was kicking his butt, and then he ran away, and I died to mobs while he was running away. It was the most tragic shit ever. So it was... It felt unresolved. Because, you know, we didn't actually kill each other. And now he actually got me. So that feels bad. I mean, it doesn't feel that bad. Because it's Demo. <laughs> GG. <clears throat> Alright. Um, let's see. My sash is a little disorganized right now, boys. But this is the next kit. It's definitely better. It is going to have more knowledge. More movement speed. And I think a little bit less... Magical healing, because I'm not wearing the Occultus Hood, but I think it's fine because Occultus Hood is too slow. Like, now we have almost 103, which isn't exactly anything to write home about, but it's better than we were just at. Um, 
But yeah, we're going to go with this. And how much do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Do I just have, oh, 10, 11. So I have 11 magical healing on this kit. This kit, I was kind of picturing having advanced healer. So it kind of sucks that I don't have it now, but it's fine because I think this is better anyway. All right, let's let's uh, let's finish this here with the meds. Demo, dude. Demo, demo, demo. Long time no see. So I think this kit will probably put us in the high matchmaker this time, which I'm totally fine with. I just hope there's actually players there. I hope there's actually players there. I would think people would want to, like, put their multi-classing builds to the test and, like, you know, get the full experience. But then again, they've been empty for a while. They've been empty for days. So <laughs> I really hope, really hope there's people up here. Magic healing Warlock still eating at one taps by Windless in the right hands. Uh, yeah, probably. But if you're overhealed, it'll be a little bit harder. It depends on how you play it, and if you have your if you have your protection pod, it'll be tough to one shot you. <clears throat> okay, uh, I don't have shields. So I need magic protection. I wouldn't mind some lock picks. Need a gold bag. Uh, I usually take something to break boxes. Uh, I should I start, should start bringing the loot because it's funnier. Can I get this in the squire? I can. Wait, I'm going to do it. Wait, I guess I could actually mine. I mean, who gives a shit? I'm not mining. Like, ain't no way. Ain't no freaking way, boys. <laughs> ain't no way. Um, Take some more protections. Why not? I, did I have protection pot whenever he hit me there, too? Because I feel like I was using mine. Man, did a lot of damage. Weirdly, Rogue might be one of the better things for multi-classing because it has so much speed in, in baked into the kit. Loot on the back confuses people. <laughs> yeah, it also looks like shit. It's clipping through my cloak. What the hell? All right, this, this setup, the nicer looking rags or the nicer quality rags do actually look better too. It's still no freaking occultist robe, but the drip is slightly better now. It's slightly better. I think overheal is not so OP. It's not so many shield. The other perk is better. Advanced healer. Uh, I mean, it's tough. I'll, I'll try them both eventually. Still a bum. Damn it. Damn it. Gage calling me out <laughs> for the hobo that I am. Damn it. <laughs> it is what it is, bro. Hobo life. Hobo life. Uh, I think I was going to use a lantern here too. Use this one, it has some healing on it. Actually, wait, I'll use this one. 114 health, 31 knowledge. This is the big thing. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 additional this time. So I'll have way more damage. I have a better book and more movement speed. This is a much better kit than the last one. Okay, what am I forgetting? Wait, I have one gold. This is what I'm forgetting, boys. The camp, the campfire for the lesser heals. My OCD is getting triggered. Damn it, there's no nice way to do it, is there? Let's just get in there. Still a bum boy with really clean gloves. <laughs> one of them church bums. I dig through the, the, the trash at the abbey. <laughs> Think you still need more health? Yeah, well, I can't really get it unless I spend a lot, so... I could get... Uh, I don't want to drop any more... I could get help on this instead of will. I don't want to drop any more... knowledge. What are you doing, bro? How fast are you? Rage Achilles. This is just a standard barb. Regular. The regular barb. Holy shit, though. He's he's going to be a problem. Oh, I'm nervous now. Alright. Bro, how is he so fast? He has, like, just agility. Is that instant focus? Yeah, this guy's not really multi-classing either. Alright. I got some tough matchups here. I don't, I don't love fighting wizards. 
He has no health, though. Wait, am I not in the high matchmaker? This guy doesn't look like he should be in the high matchmaker. <coughs> this is also just a regular ranger. I feel like inspecting is more important than ever. These people just have weird ass shit. Fighter. Sprint with a Zvi. Okay, don't care about that. Bonk Wizzy. Oh, oh, we got a abyss out, homie over here. What the hell is this? King Shield. Also not really multi-classing. Where's all the multi-classers at, boys? Crush? This guy's got Crush? What is he gonna- Oh, did they not take out the bow Crush? Uh-oh. Can you crush with the loot? Who's doing that? Have some of that. Have some of that. Okay, was this the fast guy? Yeah, this was the fast guy. Loot fight me, bro. Loot fight me, dude. If you guys didn't know, on the test server, you could break doors if you had crush and a bow. So it was basically like the drum, drum crush all over again, just with bows. This guy's really slow. I can remember this guy's instant focus. A cleric with a freaking halberd. <laughs> Why are you using that for... Okay, something is up. Oh, wait, the matchmaker got changed. I forgot. The matchmaker is now under 399 and over 399 or something. Dell says the bow crush still works. Oh, that's trash, bro. Why? Did I do or see any of the pop pickpocketing? No, dude, I'm not, I'm not into stealing people's stuff like that. <laughs> and as soon as I saw that, I just basically didn't play. I mean, they announced the hotfix pretty soon. I was trying to level uh, Barb. Uh oh, boys, did the stream disconnect? Because I have I have some weird messages on my OBS here. Oh, it's two ninety nine now. Okay, so I was in the high matchmaker the whole time. I, I feel like. <clears throat> BOC earthquake. How does that even work? Like you can't move while you're earthquaking. Looks good here. Okay, yeah. Uh, YouTube has had a lot of weird, weird things going on with it lately. Like Modex's stream, he was like midstream, and you know there was a bunch of chat activity, and yet it said he had one one viewer, and it wasn't just me chatting to myself. So I, <laughs> I know there was viewers, and uh, it also kept disconnecting his chat a bunch. He's having all kinds of issues. And that's just what happened to me. I said my chat disconnected, which like, not sure what that's about. Let me know. Let me know if anything weird happens. Someone's in here. Is it the barb? Why is he running? Oh, it's not the barb. It's a fighter. No, zombie, don't do this to me, bro. Yeah, we both waste cooldowns, that's fine. I won the cooldown game.
So I miss TM. Every single time I play TM, I think to myself, God, I miss this build. This build is so much fun. Did I blow the door off? Yeah. Unlucky. Orifice Seeker. This guy's uh, this is a weird ass name, dude. Uh, stuff is not very good. Let's take the Rondelio, I guess. I don't know. Like, is that even worth taking? Probably not. I think it's protection pots. Max health. I mean, maybe that's something. He's got two gold bags. What was his, what was his plan? Was he farming uh, Cyclops? Luck Agi? I mean, probably not. I'll probably drop this later. All right. Cool. That's fun. Not much. But I think the devs will ever actually use the test servers instead and take down the paywall so people can actually test it. Uh, in my experience, there was a lot of players. So the paywall doesn't seem to really do much in terms of the player count, but I think that was also because there was something kind of hype on the servers. It was not like it was just balance patch number 412. It was, you know, multi-classing, but Maybe they will, maybe they won't, I don't know. I don't mind it. I, when I bought the whole line edition, it was not because I wanted necessarily the test server, it's because it was at a time where it felt like our small indie company was coming through for us, you know? Like it was the time that uh, they finally beat the odds and released the game and all that. And so for me, I wanted to, to show my support, get them, get them off the ground. Bro. I don't really like spending a lot of time down here. It's kind of risky. But I do like me a golden chest. Nice. One additional. Probably not. Again, with the crappy golden chest loot, bro. Not hitting. Not hitting on the chest today. Dude could have used the ladder. He could have, but he also would have been basically giving me free curses while he was doing that. It, it was a, a play, maybe, but he was kind of cooked just because he had the low ground and I don't know. It's a tough fight. Tough fight for that build versus a warlock. have any friends don't see any I gotta get better at that bee hopping I've been starting I've actually been uh bee hopping when oh wait, he was already down here when the time is right whoa when any weird rangers are, are rangers using magic damage yet? It's a super weird cloak or uh, ranger hood. Probably, probably terrible. But what would they even use? Like, I know people were talking about smite ranger, but I haven't seen. I never saw that in the test server, and I know smite just doesn't scale anymore. So like, you wouldn't even use the true. This is probably trash. I I'm dropping that shit. Yeah, just Ranger. Upgraded camp, let's go. Does BOC work with bows? That's a good question. I would guess not because it doesn't work with torches. Or rather, thrown torches. It works with like smacking torches, just not thrown torches. Poison weapon didn't work either. Okay. All right, those are crappy. Nobody, nobody wants double max health lace turn shoes, do they? Bro, 
this is so bizarre. I'm using some like pimp gloves, smacking this shit with a freaking guitar. Wild, bro. All right, let's find some players. Kind of looted up, but I wouldn't mind finding players anyway. There's some very interesting characters in this lobby. I just don't want to fight the bar, but that's really the only guy I don't want to fight. I don't, I don't think this is anyone's been here yet. Ignite works? Oh yeah, Ignite does work on crossbow, but you have to have spells for that. Someone is over there. I'm pretty sure I saw somebody over there. Oh, it's funny that they they even addressed the mystic vestment by changing the skin. It for forever it showed up as a oracle robe. Oh man, there's no zombies in here. That sucks. Oh, there we go. Forever it showed up as a as an oracle robe on the ground if you threw it on the ground. But then they left the movement speed now, or they didn't adjust the movement speed. I, I freaking hate this spider pot. It's the bane of my existence. The guy I saw might have been doing uh, Cyclops. Probably went towards static. I know I'm coming now, but it's fine. Yeah, it's dead for sure. I have no trust right now because I'm I've been I was tormented in the bar of meta, dude. I was straight tormented. I still haven't recovered. Right, this is still closed. Probably went towards mid. Where are the homies at? On the door? Hmm. Interesting. I know I saw somebody, dude. Okay, there's the barb. It's him, bro. It's the man himself. Oh, shit. Barb fight. Okay. Somebody else is here, but... Oh, shit. There he is. Hmm, this is a very, very dangerous place to be. Get out of this. He's gonna go up though. Don't 
don't be open. It's open! No, dude. Oh, I could barely hear that, by the way. I missed the dude. The one curse hit the goblin's head instead of going over it. And that's that was the difference. I could have killed that guy if the curse didn't didn't go over the goblin's head. Or didn't hit the goblin instead. GG. It was fun. Least paranoid warlock POV. Which part? Was I flame walking everywhere? Where'd the barb go? fast. How is he so fast? He doesn't look fast. No shot. Hydra, how did you hit me, bro? GG. You have good stuff, I forget. I can drop this. This is terrible. Is this Athosan any good? This thing? Oh! Oh, a troll, dude! Troll pellet! I didn't even see it! What the hell? What? <laughs> what? What is this? Could drop the Rondelio as well. Is this even good? Not really. Necklace of Piss? Truth is? Alright. Alright. All right. Uh, nice, dude. Those are kind of good. Max health, phys damage bonus. I'm not even sure what's best here, boys. Rip here is kind of good too. Uh, what else can I drop? I feel like the rape here is probably best here. Or is it the apple stand, dude? Oh, I'm so con conflicted here. I'm taking rape here, actually. So I like protection pots a lot. Alright, this this is good for me. Sick, dude! Alright, let's go! Let's go! Okay, it was not the, the barb I was terrified of, but I love killing barbs. Again. Hold over from the barb meta. I love killing barbs because I have been tormented in the past. Yo, that was a sick run. How much are these worth these days, bro? Damn. Let's go. Let's freaking go. 3190. Can I just craft up a uh, a bag real quick? I don't have wolf pelts. I thought I had a couple. I guess that was on my other character. I'll probably use this, dude. I need more gold bags. We'll just uh, put this next to the centaur hoop over here. Not too bad, dude. Not too bad. That was a good fight. That guy definitely scared me when he got that close, when he raged out of the door. Damn, dude. What's the best build for a Nomi Warlock? Probably Chris Dagger Crystal Ball. But nowadays with multi-classing, who the frick knows, bro? Who knows? Were these from today? I'm trying to keep my loot from today up top. Because this stuff is from like previous videos and stuff. And it's cool to like see it all. Okay, what is this? Is this even good? 
Fizz damage reduction, max health, will. I think this is garbage. I think this is terrible. But, you know, it's still freaking orange. It's still orange, dude. 200. Wow, dude. Okay. That probably wasn't even worth picking up over, like, some of these loose trousers. <laughs> uh, Rondelio. This is probably not worth either, but it's small. Yeah, some of the stuff I grabbed was, like, subpar. This is crazy good, though. Holy shit, look at this thing. <clears throat> Alright, uh, that definitely wasn't worth picking up. Necklace of Piss. Cool. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I mean, kudos to that guy also for actually trying to attack me. Because he had a troll pelt on him and some juice, and he was like, Nope, Mr. Warlock, your time has come. So I respect him. I respect him for that. I need my loot back. Hell yeah, dude. Can't leave, can't leave base without my guitar. Also, I don't think I'm chugging nearly enough potions. I need to be down in these like there's no tomorrow with, with advanced healer or whatever, overhealing. Dude had a full inventory and still went for it? Yeah, dude. For real. I respect the shit out of that. That's a man who knows his priorities. His priorities are straight. <clears throat> Alright. Uh, I think I'm just good to go, right? Campfire? Bro, I can't believe I'm bringing campfires now. I love- the thing I love- or one of the things I love about Warlock is that I don't have to worry about campfires or Francesca's or any of that shit. Surge kits. But man. Alright. I think I'm just good. Does Perseverance work if you cast Power of Sacrifice on yourself? Uh, yes. Yes, it does. But it only brings it down to one instead of zero. Going in. Oh, I wish I would have finished that whiz too. Imagine that game if I finished the whiz. Holy freaking full lobbies! Let's go! This is sick! I didn't get to see what he had. Man, I'm gonna, I'm in the dark when it comes to the multi-classers. Who knows what they have? Who freaking knows, boys? Wait, quests? A brisk? Did I miss something up? Did I miss a quest? I, I'll be honest, I like very rarely pay attention to quests. The ones that kind of auto-complete, I turn them in, but I rarely go out of my way. Sprint BOC Barb? I feel like BOC on other classes, everybody assumes is going to be insane, but none of these other classes scale magic damage, so like... I feel like it's not as good as people are cracked up as, as it's cracked up to be. Oh, the troll pelt? Oh, it's for quest? There's a quest for it? I didn't know that. Oh, that's actually huge, because I don't really... I mean, I do... Oh, man. I do sometimes farm troll, but I prefer farming Cyclops. I hate... I hate this room. This is the worst place ever, dude. It, bro, I got magical healing. Who cares? Cyclops around? I can't kill Cyclops with this build or with this setup. I would need to put on Hellfire, and I could, I could put on Hellfire, but then I would have to. Uh... Oh, actually, a bit overheal would be really nice for Rockfall. Give you a little more HP insurance. I would have to uh, take off Lesser Heal. And that's why I like randomly throw my lantern. I do it all the time though. Oh, not a bad crossbow. Wait, was that a, a max max roll? No, 1614. Wait, is it? That might be a max roll for a blue. 
Can you get troll pelt in norms? Yeah, you can. Yami was saying it's actually super common as well, so I think it might even just be better to farm it there if you're looking for your quests. Get my overheal stacks up. Oh wait, it actually makes sense to double pre-buff. Or double Hydra for the pre-buff. Because now I have healing running. Hmm, somebody spawn here or nah. Hmm. No signs of it. But it could be getting played. Shit. Oh, it's two percent, so it's one in fifty. We tested perseverance yet? Nah. Well, a lot of people in my chat apparently have though. Like when we were talking about, like I showed up in my shop the one time, and everybody was screaming. If it does or it doesn't work with uh, free casting of spells or whatever. Have some of that, Mr. Crossbow. Would be so good. Well, I had this dream of being able to just infinitely spam. Infinite spam sounds fun. Bro, what are these chests? Double bardiche? Some weird shit. Yeah, like being able to infinitely spam Bolt of Darkness from range sounds kind of fun. I don't know if it doesn't sound good, but it sounds interesting. Trashola. Hmm, do I feel like breaking all these boxes? That would be a no. That would be a no. Is the mob still up right here? It's not up. Okay, interesting. I need to be cautious going in here. Especially because I actually thought I heard a footstep over there. But I also trip balls on the regular in this game when it comes to the sound, so I can't be trusted. This mob is cleared as well. Oh, he, whoa, interesting, he went down there. Oh, dude, who the frick goes down there? Here in Archer, I think that's downstairs. It was like Rogue Haven, bro. Oh, I don't like this, boys. Shit, I didn't notice there's a spike trap there. Is someone about to sprint at my face, bro? This is Rogue Haven. Oh, no, thank you. They gotta come out of there, so... Oh, no, they don't. I, it ain't worth it, bro. I mean, it's not impossible they were actually just up here. They might have gone upstairs, too. Like, I just... With the sound in this game, I can never tell where the hell people are. Hmm. He's probably creeping around as well. I hate freaking rogues. <laughs> Just kidding, I don't hate rogues. Like even that, for some reason, the spellbook sound only came out of my left ear when I pulled it out right there. Which doesn't make any sense. Like why would it be that way? 
Okay, interesting. This is the most common ambush spot in the freaking game, dude. I swear. Someone is here. Another warlock. Oh wait, he's got a uh, ruby silver on. Is it a BOC? It's a rage. That's fine, his BOC is gone. The door is open over there as well. We could have invis potted, I guess. He's definitely waiting for his cooldowns. Hmm, this is scary. This is very scary. What's with everybody? Everybody having ruby silver today. I like haven't seen anybody wear ruby silver this whole wipe until today. Oh shit! He dropped that. This guy must have had bis. Oh shit, he's here. Ah, there's two guys then, because someone was in the skelly place also. I messed that up. Grab a mob real quick. He's to the right over there. The problem is there's somebody in there too. Hmm, this is a very, very dangerous spot to be. I'm not that afraid of this guy. I'm afraid of the freaking warlock. Because I don't want to... Oh, speak of the devil. Are they teaming? What's going on there? Nah, bro. We don't risk this. He was getting collapsed by Flamewalker. Wait, it's it's gone. What? Wait, how, why didn't I go in? What just happened there? Am I tripping? You need to crouch? Since when? No, bro. It ain't like that. What the hell was that? How did I get out? I right, well, <laughs> admittedly this guy had Jack, but we don't we don't freaking teabag and stuff kind of kind of stuff here bro <laughs> true magic cloak weird plays by the homie over here I don't think I want any of his stuff. <laughs> Shit. 
Maybe you'll take vigor action speed. That's probably something. One fist power, probably not. All right. Someone's here. He's also TM. What is he doing? Also, where the hell did you just go? Am I blind? I lost him in, the, in an instant. Can you go through the door and close it? Oh, there he is. Oh no, 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 I'm lagging, I'm lagging. No, bro, I did not just DC. I did not just freaking DC. No way. Oh, I'm back, I'm back. What the hell was that, bro? Where's my man at? Did he go down? Where the heck did he go? Bro, I, I lost him in the DC. I lost my boy in the DC. He's not in there. I think he went this way. I'll kill my mobs. It's fine. Dude, that was nearly the worst possible time for a DC. I need to hurry up because uh, zone's going to be a problem soon. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, he didn't go this way. Which freaking way did he go? The portal's down here. Oh, what the heck? Someone's down there. Is that him? It's about to take a lift, probably. Did he just die to the mage? Like, where did that guy go? I'm about to die to the mage, boys. I saw my life flash before my eyes right there. Random bowler guy. Oh, thank God. All right, I'm focused up. <laughs> I'm focused up. Let me just get out of here, bro. Someone's behind me. Nah, nah, nah. We out of here. We out of here. I got enough stuff. I got enough stuff. Oh, he's dying to the bullet, dude. This was about to be me. This was about to be me. <laughs> All right, so he's got advanced healer and perseverance. Oh, wait, he doesn't have TM. Oh, yeah, he does. Never mind. Bro. I got to watch. I got to see what happens. What up, Born to Kill? How's the night going? Uh, fantastic, dude. We got uh, overhealing, which is exactly what I wanted. This guy's going to get screwed to portals, actually. Let's see why we couldn't finish our fight. Um, oh, he has he has one portal left. He's gonna be fine. <clears throat> but yeah, no, it's been it's been a great night so far. Uh, it's it's not the most crazy, interesting multi class. It's kind of just something that was gonna be strong. But the only character I had at level thirty was a cleric anyway, so I just ripped this. Um, okay, I mean, decent run though. Nice cloak. Very mediocre other cloak. Decent crossbow. Uh, true magic. I love warlock fights. Warlock fights are awesome. There's a lot of, like, thought going on. <clears throat> like, I was trying to keep him at range. I was trying to play a nice range and then, uh, freaking whittle him down. But we both had TM and there was mobs around, so it was going to be a weird fight. And then I almost DC'd. 
That feels good. This is finally the kind of multi-classing testing I've been wanting to see. I know most people want weird, crazy builds, and I'm so glad somebody is finally testing this kind of build. As always, thank you. Now, thank you, Matt Joe. Appreciate you, bro. But yeah, uh, it's it's partially because, I mean, if I could have tested something crazier, would I? I, I like can't come up with anything crazy as a Caster Warlock. Caster Warlock is kind of just really good on its own. Like, you don't need a ton of extra stuff. Warlock already has really good perks. It's like one or two spells, and then the cleric thing. And I think that's all you really need. You like Warlock fights when you're watching a third party? I mean, it's not always the easiest thing to third party, but I feel that. <clears throat> I suppose if you get that Phantomized cooldown out of the way, it can help a lot. Alright, I do need to sell some stuff because we're we're getting freaking uh, stuffed. The, the stash is full. 475. Thought about Dagger Mastery and the Poison build. Oh yeah, that'd be cool. The thing is though, like Warlock ends up scaling like for one shots or for uh, magic. So it's it's always like weird. I think it could be good though, especially in uh, normals too, actually, because <clears throat> you're not going to have additional magic. I personally, I like the additional magic scaling better than I like the additional fizz scaling for that build. You're watching two gray BOC phantomized warlocks fight each other. Walked into Holy Strike the Survivor. Love that. <laughs> Oh, shit. <clears throat> oh, these are car garbage these days. I'm gonna sell it to the vendor, bro. Lesson learned. Didn't I get... Okay, I could probably sell this crossbow pretty quick. I mean, so far, the multi-classing has not felt oppressive. But I also have a character that was level 80 off the bat. So I feel bad for the people who didn't have a character that's a decently high level. I think most other creators have way higher levels than I do. Like Yami, that dude has level infinity bar barred, I think. <clears throat> I saw him, it was like 150 or something like that. That's crazy, bro. He's, he's going to be the first guy to hit level cap. Forty-four damage. Yeah, I was just really glad I didn't have to freaking continue leveling this stupid cleric. <laughs> that's that's the real win here. Two addition. Oh, wait, these are money. Damn, bro. It's too true. Wait, why is too true so much cheaper? I wonder if I messed something up. I don't really understand that. Got right, your cleric from 1 to 19 in like three hours. Well, I mean, nicely done, but I can't. I Three hours of cleric? No thanks, bro. <laughs> no thanks. I don't, I don't like cleric. <clears throat> I'll do one additional, I guess. Oh, wait. Yeah, this is actually going to be super easy because you can search for multiple stats now. So one additional and max health. 749? Something tells me this isn't selling. Something tells me, bro. Nice. 
almost done with the selling boys. Just don't want the stash to brim. It's really the, the main issue here. Alright, that's good for now. Not intolerable. I was uh, I was leveling in crypts and I was basically just using whatever that AoE spell is that like kills all the skeletons. I was just running around doing that. And then I ran into freaking Ken Navi and Todd Father and uh they they murdered me, bro. <laughs> There's a clip of me talking shit to Ken <clears throat> on his channel. It's actually pretty hilarious. But that's how I got through it by just like clowning around in crypts. Because if I was doing, if I was playing it honest, it would have taken, it, it would have killed me, I think. <laughs> All right, yeah, yeah, this is good enough for now. Let's get back in. What do I need to, to restock on? <clears throat> just pots. I think I'm good to go. Now we're good to go. Does anyone know if the all white stats from the Cyclops Vision Crystal transfer to main weapon with Slayer or only blue ones and weapon fam? Uh, if you're talking about the weapon damage, it should work. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, Matt Joe, do you ever want to do more collabs? Absolutely, dude. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. I mean, the, the lore kind of is an obvious one because I basically just hang out in a stream all the time. <clears throat> uh, that was not like some sort of content play. He just has like the most freaking entertaining stream out there. So you'll always find me in there. So he kind of knew me from that, I think. And then Yami, I found out he watched my shit at some point as well, which is cool. So I don't know, like this happens organically. I like, I like those two because they're both really nice dudes. And I think we have similar sort of uh, like vibes and like outlook and stuff. And like we prioritize the same shit. We're out here just to have fun and make some content. Like we we're we're sweaty PVPers, but we don't, you know, we don't let it get in the way of having fun. I think, which is good. But I mean, I don't know. Like I also had that the brief collab with Foxman too. That one day, I'd be down to uh, play with him again. Who else? Freaking. I found out that Demo knows who I am recently. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I play with Demo. That dude cracks me up so badly. <laughs> I don't know. I, the YouTube guys are starting to like hang out more in each other's streams. Oh, uh, ModX as well. I'd love to play with ModX someday. That'd be sick. I don't know if you guys know him, but he is an insane, insane rogue. He, he's been grinding the streams a lot lately. Yeah, yeah. Mod would be sick. <clears throat> Demo, Demo's a League guy? I didn't know that. I never played League. It's funny because I'm like... Uh, I've played like every possible gaming genre except for MOBA. I never got into MOBAs. I play Teamfight Tactics. Like I have the League launcher and I know a lot of the champs and stuff because of freaking Teamfight Tactics. Oh, this spell memory bug, I swear, bro. I will lose my shit someday because of it. Be thankful I didn't. Yeah, well, I guess that's what they say. Most people have a very, uh, very similar response when I say that. <laughs> and it's basically exactly what you said just there. I go, you, you made it out. <laughs> I'm playing TFT right now. Nice, dude. Yeah, I actually just tried the new set. Uh, was it last night? I think last night for the first time. It was fun. I liked it. It was crazy. There was so much shit going on. Actually, in my first freaking game, I hit uh, Wukong 3. Their first ranked game. I guess we played one almost before that. Shit was crazy. What's my MS looking like? Uh, I think it's 102. 
Yeah, there's sometimes people above. I'll, I'll, I'll run it in a sec. Just gotta make sure I don't get ambushed and then I'm good to go. Ah, uh, yeah. Moving speed is 102.7. So pretty, pretty solid. But of course, boys, I am a dark and darker die hard. So I don't really play other games all that much right now. Occasionally with the boys. I have a couple friends who like don't play Dark and Darker quite as much anymore. One guy in particular. Oh, son of a bitch. I tried to look at chat. Big mistake. Just kidding. I love you guys. <laughs> watching uh, watching chat while you're doing the, the skill check is really a big mistake. But yeah, I have one friend who's like kind of signing off of Dark and Darker for a while. Play some TFT with him. Son of a bitch. Guy in here. It's another warlock. Okay. I like this. He's also TM. We can mimic low. This guy's got more random shit to curse. Random shit to curse down there. Okay. Please mimic. Please, bro. Let me through, dude. going great boys it's going absolutely amazingly <laughs> and there's another guy he's having none of that <laughs> full of guy kys bro okay <laughs> All right, this is an honorable duel. We need to make sure all the, the clowns are out of the way. All right, brother, me and you. You he gave up the position that had the uh, the shit he could curse in the cages for some reason. Out Chris Dagger me, you know who I am, bro. You know who I am. You can't out Chris Dagger me. Oh shit. He's, he's got blueberry shit. Cutthroat! Oh, he's dead. Did he die? He is dead. Holy shit, bro. Cut I don't know why I didn't expect Cutthroat. Okay. Uh, which health do I have? 34. I can't remember if that's enough. I just need my Zombos. Guys, the people that said get rid of Dark Reflection, nah, bro. Nah. Never. Not once. In a million years am I getting rid of Dark Reflection. Yo, that was sick, actually. <laughs> that was a sick fight. There's six sequence of fights. How's that? How was that rogue so close? He came in and I didn't even notice. Oh, brothers. Okay. Okay. We got some upgrades, boys. We got some upgrades. Is that better than mine? No, it's identical to mine. All right, dude. I'll take this for later. This is garbage. What is he doing with this? With the amount you spent on this kit, you really should have got a better. Better cloak, dude. Okay, up Chris Dagger upgrade, maybe? Actually, no, my Chris Dagger is superior. Look at this thing. Damn, that's a Chris Dagger and a half. Uh, I wonder what the rogue had. He's got blueberry, so I need space. I'm just gonna drop this shit now. There's no way Mr. Blueberry doesn't have nicer stuff. Oh, I should camp. Eh, I'll just sit for a second. Get my lesser heal back. Is overheal actually worth it in comparison to something like robust? Robust might be better, but I haven't tested it. 
I mean, overheal is is really good. There's no question about that. Um, it depends on how you play. If you play super aggro and not like, and don't kill a bunch of mobs, overheal is better. But if you kill all the mobs and you're usually fighting like one v ones, robust is probably better. Let's see what this guy's rocking, dude. Brother man. Oh shit! I like your name. Is this shit even good? This is horrible, dude. What am I looking at? That seems good. Additional fizz power. Additional rondell dagger build. One all. Knowledge. Okay, this guy's got some decent stuff in his inventory, too. How's he so full already? Can he kill somebody else? Sick Bardiche, but it's way too big for me to ever take. Uh... I don't know what to take here, bro. Like this is this cannot be worth, dude. There's no way. It's blue. It's it is blue. But is it worth? I can't tell, boys. I can't tell. How about something like this? This seems crappy too. This guy's got the weirdest stuff. Knowledge shut up. Uh, uh, bro. Uh, I'm lost. I'm lost. I'm stun locked. My brain. Oh wait, I can do this. Surely, surely something. Maybe the other guy had better stuff. Armor pen is big? Wait, which one? Party chip, tell me. I don't know rogue stuff. Mr. Rogue, this thing? You're telling me this thing. All right, all right, Mr. Chip. If you're lying to me, I'm gonna dislike your next video. I'll do it. I know that's, that's extreme, but I don't like being lied to, brother. <laughs> These are kind of sick too. Damn, bro. I want to take all this stuff. I don't have that much room. Oh, how did I almost miss this? Sheesh, bro. Equip Bardiche. No shot. Chris Dagger, too important. Guys, if you don't know Party Chip, he makes, uh... I guess it's not just road content. You make a bunch of different kinds of uh, classes, but... He always has really interesting and good takes on the state of the game. So if you like that sort of thing, you should check out his channel. Alright, I'm gonna I'm just gonna curse some shit up and try to get the static. You were trolling, Mr. Chip! Alright, everybody. No no no, I'm not gonna <laughs> I'm not gonna mobilize. Uh I'm just liking your next video, bro. I'm doing it. I'm doing it, bro. You've you've dug your own grave on this one, bro. I'm it's blue, dude. I have to take it. It's blue. <laughs> notice notice he doesn't tell me he was trolling until after i plugged his channel i don't know guys i don't know kind of sus <laughs> all right let's see if the static is open all right mob is still up which is good Got the other gloves? Nah, bro. Blue. Blueberry gloves on top. In my heart. Maybe not in reality, but in my heart. Oh, let's go! Let's freaking go. <laughs> Is it a mistake to drop meds for enemy player items? Uh, if you are gonna get out soon, it's not. But sometimes. I'm also a warlock, so I can I can just heal my heal, my, heal myself most of the time. Oh, this is this is Barb drum meta, boys. By the way, it's gonna be back. Mark my words. You can get like a forty damage drum. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Actually, on like a mostly naked Barb, I was hitting like fifty two to the head with a with a drum I had yesterday. Dude, we got some blueberry shit, some blueberry swag. Uh, okay, this is a super interesting chest. One all five strength, three magic heal. This guy saw the nerf to robes and was like, all right, it's tunic time. And I respect it. I'm probably gonna use this at some point. I don't know if I'm gonna use it today, but I'm gonna keep this for, for myself. <clears throat> this thing is pretty good. Uh, very, very nice book. I love, I love a book like this. Excellent. Wait, where the hell is my kits? Okay, here we go. 
Um, weird mask. Like, I might also use that. I don't know. Maybe. Pretty good boots. Are these better than mine? I mean, they're faster. Uh, I'll save them for later. Another good pair of boots. I, I love when I can just loot a guy and just take his build and just... I don't, I don't need to worry about my next build because this guy just gave it to me. That's sick. Anyone can throw a drum now? Yeah, dude. It's kind of sweet. Wait, are, how good are drums at breaking boxes? Are they better than the stupid loot? I bet Barb crushes them one shot still. All right. All right. We're, uh, we're making some money this stream, boys. Multiclassing is sick. <laughs> So that dude didn't have any damage. Like this thing, I guess that's probably why he wanted to melee. But he didn't have magic damage on this. Wait. On his neck or his hat. So I think he was wearing this thing. Interesting. <clears throat> Wait, oh, Van Van Vanatix, that was you, bro? GG. You tried to out Chris Dagger, the Chris Dagger goat, man. That's that was your biggest mistake. But I respect your commitment to the one true melee weapon. I, I do. I very, very much respect that. <clears throat> um, okay, blueberry. Yo, this is sick. Nice ring, dude. This must have been yours. Okay, yeah, you had you had a lot of health. Yeah, I very much like a lot of your stuff. That's going in the kit tab. Straight to the kit tab. GG thought your bolt did more damage since you had six souls. I'm not sure the bolt actually hit me. I think it... I mean, maybe... I, I was in too deep, bro. I couldn't see shit. <laughs> I, I was I was in the sauce, so I, who knows if, uh, if it hit or not. I'll trust you, though. I think their low rogue was in the chat as well. Oh, where's he at? Uh, I'm not scrolling that, that far. If you're still here, GG to you as well. That was fun. I was actually screwed if you didn't die to Dark Reflection there, so that's nice. <laughs> Character flinched, but your health didn't move. Oh, no, Reg. Bro, I hate Bolt of Darkness, and that's one of the reasons. The The hitbox is always weird, and it, like, I swear on my screen, sometimes I'll cast it, and instead of going straight, it goes like weird, like up and to the right in some stupid direction. So, yeah. <clears throat> All right, let's, enough talk, boys, enough talk. Let's get back in there. Dude, Magical Healing. It's been a while since I played Magical Healing, and this is feeling so freaking good. You want to try out Survival Bow, BOC? I'm not sure BOC actually works on uh, bows. I think Shadow Touch doesn't work either. So I like where your head is at, but I don't think either of those work, dude. Unfortunate. What up, Jin? Can I smoke a cigarette on stream? Uh, when my when I turn my face cam off, I'll light one up for you. But I can't do it until the face cam is off, bro. <laughs> You're gonna have to just trust me on this, dude. That I'm I'm gonna do it. The cleric heal you did healed you for so much. I know, dude. Lesser heal actually is so broken. Uh, so broken on Warlock. It's so freaking good. Like, you, you're topped off no matter what, pretty much. Uh, and, like, if you have overheal, it'll even overheal you, too. Okay. Uh, what am I missing? There's always something, boys. There's always something. I think we're just letting it rip. I think we're just letting it rip here. Boom. Nah, nah. Hey, we're good. We're good. You got multi class? Yeah, basically. <clears throat> what is this? A rogue with a bow. Oh, where he's juicing. <clears throat> Seems to be good for those oh shit moments. Oh, yeah, for sure. Have I considered getting whiz spells? Uh, yeah, I tried like the bonks thing once on the on the uh what you call it on the test server but it made it very clear it was clear really soon that uh it's better to go the other way it's better to get warlock shit on wizard i think 
because <clears throat> you get a bunch of you get 10 free knowledge over a warlock so I, mean, I don't know what else you would take i mean i've seen people with chain lightning so they throw their hydra down and then chain it right away which seems kind of good or seems okay anyway foxman did did that oh i haven't watched that vid yet i did see he posted it though i'm gonna farm this for xp it's an xp farming kind of game anyway or these days with the multi-classing so why not Firemaster applied a flame walker. I mean, it should. I don't. I didn't test it, but if it doesn't, it's bugged and it'll fix it. I don't think that's actually that strong though, because like, yeah, it reduces healing, but in in what scenarios is that even like beneficial? I think that I think firemaster actually kind of sucks, unless you're in trios. Oh, I also tried fireball on Wiz or on uh, on Warlock. But the problem was, like, hit sucked, so my fireballs were never enough to kill anybody, and every single other person had lesser heal. So I lost all the casters, because they would just heal themselves back up, and my fireballs were just gone. It was- it was bad. It was so bad. Yo, these are sick, actually. It's too bad- It's too bad no one will ever use them, but they're actually kind of sweet pants. <clears throat> Alright, where to, boys? This is mid. It's the bow rogue. I can't give a shit about this, bro. I'm a warlock. Oh, I actually don't have anti magic on. Shouldn't be too cocky. Divine Prince. Wait. Is that Smite? Is he, he's in this cubby, dude. And there he is. Oh my god, what the? Smite bow? No, no way he lives this, right? He's alive, dude. Where'd he go? Is he dead? Is he hidden right here? <clears throat> GG. That was cool. That was fun. So, he, wait, he smites before he goes in biz? Is that what he's doing? Interesting. The bow hurt like shit though. Holy crap. Well, I did do so much damage. You must have a lot of additional fizz. I knew that guy was you, so I was specking him. Doing the forbidden jutsu here and just uh, spinning him around the circle. Get both us both at once this way. All right, it's Chris Jack. Time. I had enough of this. Yeah. How's this one not dead? Also. And because I'm warlock, I have no idea what's going on upstairs, because I'm, I'm completely deaf from all the bullshit. Hi, right, Mr. Rogue. Good fight. You're a very broke man. Well, he's no less broke now. It's kind of a good servo. I think I think servos sell. 
Uh, okay, this guy wasn't as used as I thought. He had a lot of high quality stuff, but none of it is actually that good. And this is pretty good. I mean, action speed padded. Those are probably worth taking, maybe. I don't know, bro. This guy was not on the uh, the movement speed meta. He didn't have any movement speed. Oh, 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 that's pretty good. I like that. I like that a lot. Anyone know if these are worth taking? I have no idea. Rondell might sell. Okay. Good read on the hide. Yeah, I knew he was here. When those guys turned around, he had to either be dead or hiding. And I also knew that I should be able to one-shot him. So if he dodged my attack, I was boned. So maybe that wasn't the best, the best idea. But... You know, we live life on the edge, boys. You know how it be. You know how I roll. I take the risks. I know Bro Cowl's actually kind of good. Modex wears this. Hmm. I I I don't know. I don't care. It's too much too much thought. Oh, I gotta check centipedes. Ooh. Action speed. Mr. Peed. Three additional fizz, maybe. Top off. Get some healing going before we go upstairs. That was a fun fight. That was a cool fight. That was very cool. How much MH do I have? I think I have 11. Or wait. No, on this kit I have... No, I do have 11. I have 11, yeah. 11 is fine with me. I don't need any more than 11. <clears throat> is 3x3 three three back? No, this is 5x5. Uh, five five. Oh, well... No, I haven't gotten it yet, so I, it probably isn't back. It is weird they had it on a test server, huh? Alright, what do I do now? I'll kill another centipede, I guess. For the XP. I don't really need any more loot. Probably right, because of the player count. Yeah, but I feel like the player count was the same. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. I felt like the player count was the same on 5x5 and on 3x3. Uh, three three. So it was, it was much more interesting to get the 3x3 three three on the test server. Did I just make a footstep sound by rotating? No. I think someone's in there. Of your warlock, so you can multi-class with cleric. Uh, I can't remember whose video I was watching, but I saw some cleric that had Curse of Pain and just looked funny. Yeah, probably not that. Like, seeing any other caster use Curse of Pain was, is just very strange. I also forget where I spawned, so I don't know if that if I cleared that shit or not. I think I spawned in this room. And that is cleared. So that's where the road came from. Interesting. Going in. Wish I had advanced healer? No, I didn't get it. I got unlucky. But I will say, Lesser Heal is, is broken. The Lesser Heal is so good. I think we were the ones in there, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Budget Chad. What build should I run for Solo Cleric? Alt F4, bro. Alt F4. <laughs> no, just kidding. Uh, I liked... I liked Smite. Smite Divine Protection, build all, all kinds of movement speed. The melee one seems like the best. And when you're building for melee, it's a little bit... You, clearing PvE is easy, so you get a lot of XP. Which perk would I change? That's the thing. All the perks I, I really, really like from here. Like, you're, you're maybe changing out Vampirism, but I don't know how good that actually is.
PDR caster. I mean, if you're leveling, I think PDR caster is kind of bad until you get a lot of magic damage. I'm a mid mid. In theory, people will come to me, right? Right? Where the homies at? I already killed everything downstairs. All right, guys, we're going to talk real quick about what I think they should do to spice up the GC. Because right now, it's like everybody goes troll to try and counter troll, and that's where most of the shit is. And then occasionally mid as well, just because like the static is here. And if you wanted to spice up the GC, one thing you could do is you could take this 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 freaking spider module here, right? With the spiders and the centipedes in the bottom, like the pile of skulls and shit down there. You take that and you put like maybe you make the centipede like a freaking nightmare centipede and it's like a special centipede and then you also take like this module up here and you put a special centipede in there you know how there's like a barrel and uh like a bunch of water in the bottom and stuff and like a hell shrine and then you take that shit there's a special centipede and if you kill both you like take their head or something and then bring it somewhere and you like put it on an altar or something and it gives you a shit ton of loot so then instead of it just being the two bosses that are the hot spots, you go and you take some other part of the map and make it worth actually going to. So that there's PvP over there, there's PvP over there, there's PvP at the Cyclops, and there's PvP at the other one. And then every time somebody goes through mid to go between the two, it's just a, a freaking madhouse. It's just like PvP all over the place in here. So f for one, the troll room won't be quite so contested. There'll be... There'll be more things to do than sit outside troll room. And if you want to go fastest between the two, you'll have to go through this place, which will be risky because that's where everybody crosses over each other. Yeah? Not bad, right? Not bad. Armchair dev right here. I'm an armchair dev. <laughs> I just think they should add more places of interest in the Goblin Caves so it's not just everybody camps troll. I think players would be happier. There'd be more shit to do. And there's, I mean, like someone like me can make more content about it. Like, you know, there's not just farming troll all day on repeat. There's, oh, I'm going to do double centipede runs or some shit like that. You know, I don't know. That's just my two cents. Random idea. Shower, shower thought, you know. <clears throat> okay, we have problems, boys. The loot is piling up too high once again. And those riveted gloves really sell. Holy shit. Sounds cool, but you think it'd be cooler if they made Troll Cyclops easier to defend? But they made it, you were able to hear them from further away. Interesting. Maybe. I really like boss counters, personally. I think they're really fun for both parties. Like, I know a lot of people get pissed off when they kill the troll and then, like, dudes rush in. But for me, it's like, you know, it's part of the fun is, like, having to, like, guard what is rightfully mine, you know? Or what I earned. Because it's not actually yours until you can defend it, you know? Like, the double boss room was a really cool idea. But... It's, uh... I don't know. Like, once you've done it a couple times, it just it's just whatever. It's just whatever. <clears throat> Points of interest on the map, I'm telling you. A lot of stuff that people uh, get upset about could be solved with just adding more points of interest. Okay, um, I think I have to start selling some shit so that my freaking inventory has space in it by the time we get back next time. <laughs> Ooh, that's a nice Wanderer's Attire, man. Action speed, was it Fizz Damage bonus? Fizz Power. Hmm. I don't know what to price this for. One all with magic damage bonus and luck. I don't think magic damage bonus is anything here. But one all, on the other hand. You don't like that you need gear to contest people stealing boss loot. But don't want to bring loot for Cyclops because you can get unlucky and one shot by a falling rock. Yeah, I get that. I definitely get that. <clears throat> 3k for the blue? Uh, yeah, probably, but whatever. If you want it, you can buy it. <laughs> 
I'm not gonna relist that. Yeah, I mean this is a sick this is a sick wanderer's attire. <clears throat> Alright, cheapest one all. I usually straight up like scan myself because I don't like thinking about and searching for the correct price, so I just get whatever price I can get and call it. <clears throat> Peace of mind is worth gold to me. I'd like to see multiple layouts again. Pretty tired, just the same format for GC and Ice Caves. Uh, I somewhat agree, but there's always a layout or two that I get pissed off by. Like in Crypts, there's that one layout with the maze in the middle, and it's just such a pain in the ass to go anywhere, and all the modules suck. I hate that one. So I, I get the, the variety aspect, but I really don't like... I, I, it sucks when like some of the layouts just suck. I really like the 5x5 five five layout, personally. Like, just the bottom left is, uh, is kind of shitty. Everywhere else is good on that map. And the blue things are too high because people are feared to go 300 plus. That is what it is, man. <clears throat> if people want to game the system, they're going to do it. Nothing we can do. Do you buy three felt like a Thunderdome? Oh, party chip, though. I, I'm a I'm a big fan of the Thunderdome, bro. That's why that's where I have the most fun is in the freaking Thunderdome. I, I, I've said it. Well, actually, I can't remember if I included it in the last video or not, but sometimes when I'm recording a video off stream, I just like go off on tangents and talk about shit. And I usually don't end up putting them in the video because not everybody wants to hear me yap. <laughs> but uh, yeah, man, I, I, I'm a big fan of the like craziness of the three by three. And like, if I don't get to, to loot my kill, I think it's fine. As long as I'm like stimulated for the entire run, you know, as long as I have adrenaline going for a lot of it, it's fine with me. I will take some some lost loot if it means, you know, more than just one fight per game. Well, the stream's a great place to yap because people, you know, you can't it's like more long form in a, in a concise video. I feel like people click away and then the algorithm doesn't like that or some people click away. I've been thinking about doing like shorts, yapping shorts, basically, <laughs> where it's just like some take about the game. I think those might be fun. <clears throat> I don't know, though. Oh, speaking of yappers, party chip, dude, party chip's a big time yapper. So I guess you probably uh, you probably get that <laughs> in a good way, in a good way. He has good yaps. Why I sub to him. We love the yap, yeah, baby. <laughs> Damn, this rapier is two ninety nine. That's not bad. Keep the yap, and the boys love the yap. And all right, <laughs> all right, Matt. You want again the three floor crypts? Yeah, I really, really wonder what they're doing with ruins and like when they plan on bringing that back. Because surely it's coming back, like, soon-ish. There's no way this is going to be gone for this whole wipe. Also, I have no idea how long it's been since the last wipe. It feels like a really long time, but has it even been a month? Or is it? are we over a month at this point? Aw, oh, shit. This thing sucks. Yo, guys, what would be a cool resourcefulness build on a Warlock? Is it, uh, is it resourcefulness BOC? Like, I haven't really seen anybody do, uh, like, cooldown abuse for, like, high resourcefulness or whatever, except Yami. I think Yami made a video. But, uh, like, what is, what is the thing that you would want to get off cooldown fast? Maybe that's the, uh, the build we were talking about with, uh, this thing. Protection from evil, dark reflection, and arcane shield. POC Phantomize would be best. Oh, true. Divine Protection BOC. Well, the thing about BOC Phantomize is if you get them with your BOC, it's it's over, dude. It's straight over. So like in a in a long drawn out fight, 
the resourcefulness has the most value, but in BOC, you're trying to end it with one hit. So I'm, I don't know. I don't know how that shit works. <clears throat> Either way, let's just, let's just let it rip. Oh, I guess I get multi-class, bro. Who cares? I can just get anybody's skill and run it. That's a fast... What the hell is this? Is this a hatchet barb? Something legendary? Legendary double axe? Okay, bro. Okay. Alright. 40% magic res. I see you. <clears throat> Wait, did he have any multi-class? A chilies? Longsword fighter. With reckless? That's bold. That's super bold. Oh, well, I didn't really see anybody. <clears throat> Wouldn't it be funny if you could have permanent rage or sprint uptime? Like if your resourcefulness was so freaking high that you were just sprinting the entire match. Now that would be something. You just alternate them. You get a bunch of buff duration and resourcefulness. So you're just fast as shit. Ooh, that sounds like a thing. I feel like Ranger abuses the cooldown the most out of anybody. Because you get the multiple shots and stuff. The multi-shot. The cooldown's already pretty low. Crazy except they nerf speed. I mean, yeah, but if you're still running around at 310 movement speed all the time, ain't nobody turning their nose up at that. Staff Mastery unlock any good? Uh, it's fine, but I think it's better to get lock stuff on, on Wizard than the other way around. That was my experience with it. Alright. Not too bad. Oh, loot upgrade, dude. We're playing some songs now. Somebody's here. He's got, is that the victory straight guy? Took Hydra? Bro, you cooked yourself. If you hit me with dark, your dark reflection might have killed him if you hit me. Where the hell do you go? You die? Did you go up and I didn't see? What the hell just happened? Where'd he go, dude? The cooldown's back, so I don't really care if he hits me. Yeah, he ran away, but where, dude? Did he go this way? Can you go all the way through? Where is he at? Is he gonna have his weird... Was that a windlass? Might be dead in the water, bro. Wait, this is a dead end, I think. He might, he might have just run all through all that shit. I don't know, dude. It's possible he died to uh, to the flame walk. I did hear them saying something about. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, he died. <laughs> I was like, there's no way I, I lost him that easily. Like, what? <laughs> he just disappeared. Be true, maybe. 
<laughs> He's a sneaky one, this guy. <laughs> Uh, move speed? I don't know. This stuff is kind of mid. Kind of mid. Oh, it's nice windless, but I don't think people buy those. Shred a lot of meds. I respect it. He knew one windless was GG. You think he died during Phantomize? I don't remember if uh, my shit was still up or not. Should have closed that door. It's fine though. Wow, dude, terrible chests. These test chests are not worth getting scammed on these lock picks. Maybe I should have grabbed the long sword so I could break stuff easier. Yeah, whatever. Who cares? He spawned here. I hate when people don't close this shit. If you guys didn't know, you can do this. Close that shit. Nobody likes mobs running all over the place, dude. Okay. Can't let them out of their cage. Loot for breaking boxes? Yeah, I do have the loot. chest. Oh, Warlock. Hello. This guy looks like BOC Phantomize. Just from his outfit. So I need to make sure I'm by that, uh, that door over there. on here, bro. He's got a staff. He might be multi-classing staff mastery. I don't have range, so I can't really do anything about this. You coming through or what, bro? Come to me, bro. Do it. Okay, he's not. Oh, shit. He's a bonk. He's a... He's a bonk, was he? You gonna push past or what, bro? This Hydra's a dumbass. And you like that? This thing is really good for me though, I flame walk bro. He almost griefed himself. <laughs> oh, he's got life life train hydra, interesting. I didn't think he would. Alright, he's actually not that fast, so I can take this guy. I'd like to push him over here, though. And the bonk is kind of scary. He probably has BOC. I'm out of magic protection, which kind of sucks.
today, bro. Oh, GG. <laughs> that was funny. That was a good fight. That was very tactical. One all. These might go. Oh, shit. Really nice pants. Damn. We like to see. Oh, okay. Okay. This guy's got some super nice stuff, dude. Sheesh. GG, bro. Zyko, was it you, bro? Good fight. That was sick. That was a that was a really really fun fight. I probably dropped this. Okay, I'm definitely dropping meds. Uh, this thing kind of sucks, but I that's what I'm saying, dude. Warlock fights are so tactical. I love them so much. Like he he one shots me. If he touches me, I die for sure. So it was just a matter of like keeping my distance, understanding where I could like keep him off me using Flame Walker. That was a really good fight. These are kind of cool. Do I do I take these? I, I have never... His gloves are good? Okay, I, I don't ever see items like this, really. These are also really good. Holy shit. Okay, screw those things. This is bad. Or this is cheap, anyway. Not necessarily bad. How about staff? Is staff better than this thing? I don't know what staffs go for. Wait, do I just put these on? These are sick, dude. Oh no, they don't have move speed. So are we staying Flame Walker every build? Yeah, bro. Flame Walker is so freaking good. All right, I'm dropping this. I don't that might be a bad idea. But in the play in the test server, the bonk staff. Staffs were like insanely expensive because bonk staff was OP. I guess Smite got nerfed, but still. <clears throat> Alright, now we do the same thing we've done the last like eight rounds and try to get the static over here. Really, bro? Really? This is why we have overheal. There's a guy in here? He's freaking cleric? bad. Nah, I'm getting there first, bro. You're too slow. You're too fat. You're too clear. <laughs> GG. GG. Oh, Vampiro is going to take you out, though. Vampirito. Are you cooked now, cleric? My money's on the warlock. Wait, what the heck is this? Smite? Phantomized Smite? Is this better than BOC? It doesn't scale. There's no way that's better than BOC. Oh. Place your bets. Place your bets. <laughs> Too cleric. Yeah, dude. I've played the class. I know what's up. <laughs> all right, all right. Oh, this is it. No, no. All right, it's a draw. Is it a draw? Come on, Vamp. I believe in you, bro. Turn Chris Dagger? Ah. Oh. I thought he was going to give him a quick turn. Dude, I love pants like this. Look at, look, every single kid I have has uh, freaking loose trousers right now, by the way. They're actually so great. I might switch these out, actually, for the loose trousers later. BOC is only one hit, Smite is multiple. Yeah, but Smite doesn't scale, so BOC can scale off of your crystal ball, your staff. It can scale off of your gear, so like additional magic damage and all this stuff. I feel like BOC is way better. Like, when's the last time you BOC'd somebody to the head and they live to tell the tale? I think BOC is better. <clears throat> GG, Zyko. That was a really fun fight, if you're still here. That was sick, bro. Yeah, haste is haste is something else too. When a when a caster uses haste, 
Like I expected that guy to be way faster. Actually, I expected if if he had moving speed boots instead of these and loose trousers instead of oh he did have loose trousers. Anyway, moving speed boots instead of these, I might have I might have had a harder time. All right, bro. I mean, this is uh. This is quite the successful freaking stream so far, boys. Very, very successful. Look at this, bro. Oh, wait, it's the same as mine. Dude, this guy, I like the way he builds his kits. Do max health. It's an upgrade on some kit somewhere. <clears throat> true magic, true magic. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Um, okay, just the rapier sold. I'm running out of space, boys. Haven't kept up with the multi-classing that well recently, so I don't know smite versus, but it seems clean. I mean, but it's me seems clean. I don't know what you're trying to say, but yeah, uh, it's it's just the scaling. Like things that can scale are always going to be better, but it, it scales with attack speed. So if you're using some high attack speed build, smite is good. But if you're using Something that hits hard and once, uh, BOC is definitely gonna be better. Do I think overheal is worth? Oh yeah, bro. Overheal is dope. I love it. I love it so much. I am willing to drop anti-magic for this, and that says something. Why do I have a loot? I had to break boxes, Reaper. Okay. More pots, and we're going. Oh, magic protection. Yeah, that kind of made me realize I probably should be bringing more magic protection, huh? Do something like this. Lock picks. BOC flute. <laughs> yeah. I feel like I never see flute kills anymore. I mean, not anymore. I saw like two ever. <clears throat> What's better, overheal or 5mh? I'm not sure. The thing is, I find the difference between a mid and a high-end warlock kit usually is just HP. That's that's like the main difference. And so if you can get a, a perk that gives you just more HP, I think it's hard to, hard to look at that and say that's not going to be the best. Straight up, I think I think overheal is probably better, but I don't know for sure. And robust would also be good, Emmett. Yeah, there's just less barb stuff that you would even want. Like multi-classing into barb is fine, but like most of your pools are going to be shitty. Is the Chris Dagger still fine? You goddamn right, bro. You can't keep a good man down. Chris Dagger is still on top, top neck. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. <clears throat> All right. Um, I'm gonna run to the bathroom quick. But when we get back, we'll be in game.
All right, we're back. Oh my god. What? Why did that? Why does that happen, bro? What the hell, dude? I'm sorry about that, guys. The freaking when I change scenes, sometimes the uh, every single song that I have on the soundboard just plays at the same time. It's annoying. I don't know why it's doing that. I gotta figure that out. <clears throat> Loose to listen to that kind of music. I on my and acid. Nice, dude. This barb is wearing. That's not a barb. That's a warlock, dude. Interesting. Um, yeah, I wish I could actually keep that music, that song going after I change off of that scene. That'd be cool. I like that song. Buckler. Buckler Rogue. That ain't no barb. Yeah, dude. That's no moon. The the Terminator helmet makes it look like a barb. Wait, why does it seem really fast? It's just rage. What's this guy doing? It's just a copper. Phantomize True Shot Ranger. Wait, Phantomize Ranger actually seems... Oh, that's high. That's not Phantomize. I'm full of it. Is most of the music I listen to that kind of music? Uh, no. So, I listen to, right now I listen to a lot of drum and bass. Well, I guess that's sort of electronic, but I listen to a lot of drum and bass. I listen to like hip hop beats. I listen to, I mean, back in the day I used to listen to only hip hop, um, like in college and stuff, but you know, tastes change over time. Yeah, Phantomized Ranger sounds good. Sounds way better than Hyde, to be honest. Like it, Phantomize would work the same way it does for a Warlock. It's an escape tool. I mean, you don't heal while it's going on, so it's not quite as good. But, you know, an escape tool is great for a ranged damage dealer. Royce made a whiz vid called Best Wizard on My Block. I'm addicted to that song. I know I've seen that one. I've watched all of his vids. Speaking of Royce, where, where the heck is he at, man? I need more Royce vids in my life. The first Royce vid I ever saw was the one... I don't know what it was called, but it was... Uh, obviously, the music was chill, but he like danced with a magic missile like this for like two minutes and it was a really sick vibe somebody spawn here i don't think someone can spawn here if i spawn here if i spawn where i did yeah, ain't no way we'll get some xp though Don't let your high asses distract me, dude. Uh, I've been around enough high asses in my day to not be phased. Don't you worry, boys. Close. Hide only seems worth it on other classes of the ambush. I mean, hide barb besides that, but yeah. Like any class where gap close is really important, I think it could be good. Like even PDR fighter, I think it could be strong. You combine it with a movement speed ability. What is that mummy doing? Where have you been, brother? Oh, speaking of creator collabs, should I do uh, should I do a stream with Royce sometime? I know he doesn't usually have voice in his uh, in his videos, but he's actually like the nicest dude. <laughs>
when this ranger hide is disgusting i mean yeah anything with, like very high damage or one shots where you need to like set up a free a free hit and that's gg that the hide's gonna be good yeah well, i've played with royce a couple times he's uh he's super good <laughs> whatever on stream and if you look close, you'll see occasionally I'll, I'll appear in my videos, but I, again, I don't really make group play all that much either, so it's uncommon. Should we go back to the well? I feel like I've been killing everybody over in that top corner today. Maybe I'll head over there. Please. Please. Oh, someone was here. Now oh, we gotta buff up for this. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Damn it. That scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Oh, I love this bug. This is the best bug ever. Alright, this guy knows what they're doing. They entered from the correct side. They might have fought already. Something's up. What's going on, boys? What am I missing? Were they in the water? Were they down below in the water? Because shit is dead, but also there's an open door towards this room. Might be being sneaky in here, boys. I honestly, I thought I heard a potion also. Yeah, uh, I did too. But I'm not I'm not going back in there cuz I hate that place. <clears throat> I think they might be underneath over there. But like I said, I trip balls all the time in this game. So who knows? It's either my tripping balls ass or your high asses. One of the two is uh got to have heard what actually happened, right? <laughs> also, this mob shouldn't be here. Somebody was definitely up top. Oh, okay, that, that door is open. They probably went out that way. Let's curse up some random shit, and then I'll go in there. Good old ball trip. Yep, I'm an expert at it. They went to the right. Skelly's still up, I'm pretty sure. Yep. Wait. Is Skelly not up? Oh, Skelly's not up. Okay. This doesn't belong here. Skelly's up. Bro, I feel like I'm on somebody's tail, but I just can't find him. Maybe they went down. They might be doing Cyclops. They bend around. Go this way. Did I test advanced healer? No, I wasn't able to get it in my shop. Wait. Here's something downstairs. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Please live. Oh shit. I just have a weird feeling. I'm gonna protection up even though I don't normally waste these.
There's a dead guy. We have one of these hide pools in here. It's a mimic. God damn it, dude. Oh. Oh. Cyclops is dead already. This guy does a lot of damage. Holy shit. Is there a bug stuck in the wall right here? Why can't I hear it? fight actually because uh he's gonna be fast enough to where he can get out of curse range very easily i mean he's still in there technically i can live forever right here unless somebody did double boss he has to come to me my guess he's is he's got something nice and he's gonna run up the opposite way that i choose to go go stop it with the mimic Oh, is this mod? <clears throat> is this mod X, boys? This might be mod X. Is he hiding in the freaking troll? I've seen him the way he bosses. And he usually keeps these doors open and like nobody else does that. He can't have hide if he's in here. Wait, where the heck is the... Oh, never mind. D did he run? I don't really actually want this stuff, but it's better than nothing. Question is, is double boss open? It's not. Okay, yeah, he definitely he did exactly what I was talking about. I, I'm pretty sure he either left immediately uh, when we first had that standoff, or he uh, as soon as he saw me put the hydra here, he just ran up the other side and got out. Damn, bro, I wanted to fight that guy. He, he had good gear if he's doing that much damage to me like that. Uh, did I miss anything off of this guy? Oh, uh, you know what? Another reason it could be mod is that he didn't loot this guy, and mod is on that demi grind. Bro, I have a feeling it was him. My my creator sense is tingling, boys. Check gold pile. Nah, I'm not gonna loot gold pile. I don't want to do it in the storm. I'm a warlock, but I I don't need it. Might have ran up on fighting the beetle, yeah. Went this way for the uh, the caged mobs, and I can check static. That guy might have also taken static. Oh, he did. He's waiting for it. No shot. He just ran in right now, bro. He waited for me at least. It's got mod X written all over it, dude. I know, I know. Is he streaming right now, guys? 
There's another dead guy. Uh, loot him in a second. Another. Oh wait. Never mind. It's just pot. Oh, another dead guy. Yeah. Holy shit, dude. Bro, I am guaranteed that was Mod, and he just murdered all these people. <laughs> One all, crystal ball, three Agi, wait, that's worth taking over this. Yeah, it's too many, too many unlooted corpses, bro. I, I bet that was him and he just killed all these dudes. Oh shit, that's good. Three knowledge, okay, I don't need those. How's there so much loot here, boys? What the shit, bro? There's so many dead bodies. What's going on? What? <laughs> oh no. Okay. Screw the loot, bro. Screw the loot. I'm getting, I'm getting uh, too greedy. I guarantee it. Ain't no way. Wait, there was something else I really wanted. Ooh. Wait, what was it? Shit, boys. Too true magic. No, dude. Wait, there, I'm missing something. There was something good. All right, last. I think it was on this guy, maybe. It was like occultist boots, right? One, oh my god. There's, there's too much. There's too much. Holy shit. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. Yeah, yeah, Matt. You're right. You're absolutely right. Restraint is required to live. I do not usually have enough restraint. Check rings. Nope, too late. Too late. We're out of here. I could have dropped meds. Don't care. Must live. Oh my god, he hit me. And he did infinity damage. Like, what the hell? Don't hit me again, bro. He's too strong. Don't hit me again. Oh my god. Oh, I have lesser heal. What am I doing? I forgot. Okay. Is this a bait? I should go back for the loot. Should I go back for the loot, guys? What do you think? I got 30 seconds. I can make it. Ah, oh, bro, I had so many pots I could have dropped. Shit! Shit! <laughs> oh, that was sick. What? what? <laughs> it was a freaking... So many dead players. What was that? <laughs> a tornado passed through and just left a bunch of bodies in its wake, apparently. <laughs> this was not it. There was definitely better stuff than this. So there was a... Uh... Oh, maybe I got them. I thought there was uh, another pair of occultist boots that were really good. Damn, bro, this is gonna take so long to sell. I'm like so not looking forward to this. I mean, rich rich person problems or whatever, but oh, the shitty ring. This is also like the fourth pair of uh, additional damage riveted gloves that I'll be able to sell. Minus 51 hertz. I don't give a shit about rank. I haven't I haven't tried to loot anything for rank. I haven't like tried to push rank whatsoever. I've been holding out, thinking they might make it a little easier. Um, but it, I don't know, like if they haven't at this point, maybe they just won't. Lesser heal is such an easy thing to forget about, but it's so good. Yeah. Yeah. If I would have been thinking about it, maybe I should have looted pile. I mean, no, with all that shit there, I definitely shouldn't have looted pile, but with lesser heal, I could have easily, cause coming back to circle, 
becomes trivial at that point. How does that work? You win but lose points? Well, you gotta do stuff to earn the points. And I didn't really do anything. I kind of just like ran around and scooped up all the loot from, <laughs> from other people's fights. I mean, we, we went toe-to-toe -to -toe with that one guy for a minute. <clears throat> uh, Mod is playing... Uh, he is streaming. Mod's playing Slayer Fighter, so it wasn't him. Well, whoever it was, went through that place like a freaking tornado, dude. <clears throat> oh, shit amount of gold bags. We got problems, boys. We got problems. Also, with overheal, you have health regen from your gray bar. What do you mean? Oh, yeah, wait. How does that work? Does it take the overheal health when you're in the storm? I didn't even see. I was too busy worrying about fighting that guy. <clears throat> Rich man problems? Yeah, dude. I'm in that first world camp. Also, I'm like tempted to not even bring bandages at all. I don't think bandages are really needed when you have lesser heal. When we start grinding rank? That's a good question. Uh, I... I, speaking of mod, he has been grinding for like the entire wipe so far, which has been like a month and he hasn't hit Demi yet. And that guy's insane. So it's going to take a long time if I actually want to hit Demi. I mean, I hate to be the guy that just waits until they announce the rewards and then start. But I think it, with at least one month left in the season, I'll try unless they reduce it. And then maybe I'll hit the problem is in until they change this system to not or to like maintain your highest rank when it comes to rewards i don't want to push demi on this character i might make a totally new character because this is my multi-classing character and when you're a content creator this multi-classing is content so i don't want to like brick this character by getting to demigod and then never play it again and and when you're in like voyager or when you're an exemplar and demi you you have to grind ap so hard just to not lose any so it's kind of just a terrible terrible thing to do for content for me anyway because i do like builds and stuff to get this character to demi so i'll probably start a new one at some point or maybe i'll i'll just randomly do demi on like a fighter or something weird or like a barb never been easier to grind yeah but that doesn't matter to me i'd rather grind when it was hard to be honest with you i like the challenge or rather that's it's it's not stimulating unless it's a challenge so i'd rather it be it'd be hard <clears throat> Why the loot? This is just a break boxes. It's either this or a pickaxe, and this looks cooler. It's funnier to swing a loot around than a pickaxe. Feel that, bro? Once you hit Demi, you gotta retire the character? Yeah, dude. Like, that's where buff scalp came from, dude. I initially had... Youth head shine bright over here. This was my Demi character last season. And, uh... He hasn't seen the light of day yet. This this patch. I still have all my base meds. But maybe I'll, I'll take him to Demi again or something like that. I'm not sure. Why not throw the drum? I don't know. Is it better? I try it. Here, I'll, I'll put the drum on. This next one. I don't know how many hits it takes to break. Damn, dude. Very profitable stream. <laughs> Look at this shit. I like it. I like it. Multi-classing on top, dude. All right. About, you guys are kind of discussing skill-based matchmaking a little bit here. Regarding skill-based matchmaking, or rather regarding the old ranking system, it was noticeable how much more skilled players were as you went up in the ranks. Like it is, it is not what the thing based it on. Like the, the matchmaker is based on your rank points and you could argue the rank is like, oh, well, it's based on collecting treasure. It's not really player skill, but I promise you, if you've grinded up through the ranks, you would know that the higher ranked players, except for that brief period where everybody was teaming, the higher ranked players 
surely are more skilled than the lower ranked players. And it, it's like very obvious. So yeah, like in this GBMM style, like people have better stuff, but I don't feel like I'm progressing in terms of the skill level of players around me. Like when I was going through and doing my initial demi grind last season, I got so much better because I was constantly like leveling up and going into a next tier of opponent and I could feel it and I, I got better because of it. Like I got so much better because of it. So like doing this, it's not as like granular. It's not as, uh, you know, you don't see your progress in the same way. So it's interesting. I don't know. I don't know. A complete scratch completely scratch normal rank uh that's a good question yeah i don't know maybe they'll bring it back when they announce the the season rewards who knows Ooh, is this a warlock right here this is a warlock or a freaking crystal ball plate what the shit is this this is a warlock with ice shield okay well he's screwed against me but we'll farm everybody else he, he's like so screwed against me he's not he's not fast enough <clears throat> Be nice to have again well from from a person who hates empty lobbies it may lead to a situation oh i guess never mind they're doing wait they're doing gear based matchmaking i don't know i don't know my, my thoughts on that what is this this is an old school bargain bin no multi-class looking ass ranger right here this guy is what are you, you're playing in the past bro what do you think this is 2023 are you in 300 plus right now? Uh, I, I must be, or whatever. Whatever the high tier is, I must be in. Oh, thanks, bro. Let's have a dagger fight. Oh, he's got magic missile. <laughs> is he magic damage? No, yeah, he's cooked. He's cooked a shit against me. Uh, did I just... What? Is there two other players? What is this? What the heck is going on? All I know is once you have a purple border... It's very easy to lose a kit. Oh, yeah, yeah. Once you got to Voyager... Keep trying MH and regretting it because you don't understand what's wrong. I built 15 MH with Vamp and you barely feel like you're healing. Uh, I mean, you have Torture Mastery on, right? Try Russ. I'm assuming your name is Russ. All right, Let's see the drum. Oh, this is ass. No, the drum is, is garbage for this because you have to equip it. Um, no, he's not going to shoot me hard because he has no he has no damage. He's going to get roasted. Uh, trust, trust. I mean, if he headshot ice bolts me, it's about the only thing he's going to be able to do. Or if I get greedy and try to die to magic missile. Um, wait, I was I was trying to address this Russ guy's comments. Um. For me, I only ever build 11 magical healing, and torture mastery is very punishing if you don't land your abilities. So one thing you can try to do is try to fight more often when there's mobs around. So a room like this, for example, if you wanted to, because every mob in here is melee except for that guy in the middle, you can just run around and have this fat train behind you and just curse stuff like this. And as soon as you, as soon as you find a player and you have all these mobs behind you, you are immortal. You have so much health. And so you can curse. Look, my health doesn't even go down when I do stuff. I can Hydra for free, basically. Um, so that helps. Also, in general, I also don't run Torture Mastery until I have a lot of damage. Because the kit ends up becoming more expensive when you have a lot of magical healing. And if you don't have damage, it's going to feel like shit regardless. 
no matter which build you're playing. Get back here, fool. How is this guy alive? Chris Dagger nerf, bro. I'm feeling it. Feeling it with the mob clear. Wow. Nice chest. That I mean completely garbage chest. I wonder if these guys are just going to run away when I see them. I have a feeling they are. Would I take sprint over phantomize? No, actually. It'd be, I want to try it at some point. But I think phantomize it just has such good synergy with torture mastery. Maybe on a build that isn't... Uh, torture mastery. But the thing is, you heal while you're invulnerable in phantomize. So... Like, by the time, if you have a decent amount of magic healing and maybe you curse one or two enemies, you're, like, almost full by the time Phantomize is done. So it's, like, a huge, huge swing. It also has really nice utility because you can go through mobs. So if, like, I was saying to that other guy, you have this big fat train behind you, and then, you know, somebody ends up trying to press you, you can just Phantomize through the train. And surely you'll be fully healed after that, and the, the mobs end up being a nice little blocker for you as well. So, I don't know, like, I, again, like, everything is worth a try. Because you could cast while you're sprinting, which you can't do with Phantomize, obviously. But the difference is, you're slowed by such a massive degree, like, I don't even think it matters. Like, what is my- oh, wait. What is my movement speed while I'm doing that? So I'm, not sure I'm not getting caught by somebody else. 64%, an additional like 5% or whatever it is, doesn't do shit. Like you're still gonna be slow as balls when you're casting. So it's like, meh. I don't know. That That's the thing, like Warlock is just really, really good as its own class. Like you don't need a bunch of random shit. You don't need a bunch of other shit. I'm just gonna get cocky because I don't think these guys are ever gonna kill me. I'm just gonna like blame on all this bullshit. Gonna farm some peds. Why not? Let me go check troll in a minute, see if somebody did it. Whether you're on late, glad to catch a stream. Hell yeah, dude. I am on kind of late, isn't it? Yeah, I usually try to start my stream a little earlier, but shit happens sometimes. So many ways to play log, yep. Yep. Most of them are good. <clears throat> I give a shit about your poison. Nah. I think I give a shit about cursing myself. Nah. We got overheal, boys. Is this your ideal setup right now? I think it is, dude. I don't know what I would even get with my next tokens. Like, these perks are just so freaking good. I mean, I can meme, you know? Like, I can find something that's just interesting. Not necessarily, like, gonna be the strongest meta thing. But this might be the strongest meta thing for a caster lock. You could maybe get some more spells. Like, I don't know what you would replace. I could see a world where you replace Flamewalker with uh, Magic Missile. Because I actually think Magic Missile might be better for keeping people off of you, because it basically insta-kills them. And... They don't know what's coming until they've already committed too hard, right? So maybe, maybe that'd be better. I think there's also another world where... Oh, that's not too bad. There's another world where... Uh, ten spell is a real thing on Warlock. Like, maybe you could just have, like, a Q that's a complete wizard wheel, including Magic Missile. In which case, like, you don't really need Phantomize if you're not afraid of anybody running you down. So there's some stuff here. Yeah, Robust also might be better than Overhealing, potentially, too. Like, there's all... There's a couple of ways that you could, like... You could tweak it, but I think the setup is... If not the best, damn near. Already. This is, like, the hugest innovation, though. Like, Lesser Heal is freaking bonkers good with this. Bro, I saw this, like, plume of smoke and thought it was a player down there. It's like, set of rogue? That's where I came in, right? Yeah. Running 10 spell and trios? Yeah, yeah, I was doing that too. Uh, I was doing 10 spell and trios even before I had multi-classing. I think 10 spell and trios is just doable. If 
you position well, you don't really need Phantom Eyes. Or at least when there's not a shit ton of rogues around, you don't need it. Like maybe if your homies are always dying and uh, you want to be able to like 1vx, Phantom Eyes might be good. Marker will always give you the space you need. Well, if people start running like Iron Will, Anti Magic Barb, or some shit with max movement speed, Lizard Skin, I, I could see it not being enough. Would Magic Missile be enough at that point? Hard to say. If you had a bunch of true damage, probably. Your homies are dying. Oh, okay. <laughs> multi class spells. Yep. Yes, sir. Oh shit, dude! Look at this! Damn! That's sick! That's a really good ring! Nice, bro. Worth. I never kill centipedes. This is so worth. I, I don't even know where I'm going. I kind of need these guys to just come to me because I don't want to clear any more mobs. Where are the homies, dude? Where are the homies at? They camp in statics? Goblins are up over there. What was that? Oh, there's another peed over here. Oh yeah, boss room. I was going to check troll. So it was a ranger and a warlock. So the warlock's never going to be able to run me down. I don't even need to pre-flame walk into here. But I do need to look for traps. Uh, nothing's dead up here. Checking anyway. Surely. That uh, that guy might have had... Wait, even if he had Hellfire. I don't know. Maybe he longsword of Cyclops? Aw, oh, come on, man. You crept, cre creep BOC to guy? Yeah, that does feel bad. For him. <laughs> More sick jewelry? No. In my experience, when there are these dead lobbies like this, usually those dudes are just gonna farm. Like, my guess is. Man, dude, I am tripping. I thought I heard a footstep. Um, my guess is there's gonna be one camping this static down there, and there's gonna be one camping this static all the way up in the corner up here. That's my guess. I hate getting to that static, so I'm not going to check it. I am going to check this static, though. But last time I was here, the mobs were still up. Is there a dead mob over there? No, it's not. Wait. No, it's not. Damn it. Come on, bro. Lantern's gonna block me. Using BOC victory strike? That's a weird combo. It is a high high damage combo. Don't you dare, you guys aren't taking this portal. You're getting murdered. This is what happens because I don't loot stuff. I don't kill players. I don't get shit. I bet somebody's at that static over there. What's the easiest way to get there? I think it's to go through here. Come here, Bola. Screw you. Another bola? Come on. Damn it. How much MH do I have? I have eleven right now. 11 is all I need in the modern day, personally. 
I'm not a I'm not a sustain abuser. I'm a, a damage abuser more than that. I care a lot more about damage. Oh, I spawned here. Come on, bros. Where you at? Where you at? Did I somehow get into like a different matchmaker this game? I took a freaking drum. That was that the difference? I shouldn't be. Uh, I guess there's one more static all the way up north, but it's I mean at this point it's either taken or I don't know what. I'm getting out of here. Uh there's one more centipede I can kill, I guess. Maybe I'll get something else like this. It'd be cool if mobs were weaker in storm. Oh, that's an interesting idea. I feel like they should be stronger in storm. Wait, where's the peed at? Oh there he is. I feel like they should be stronger in storm so they can like randomly one-shot you and stuff. Oh shit. And it punishes people that wanna just storm walk all game. Take the chicken exit. Let's see if someone can get Dagger Mastery plus Slayer plus BSB. I really wanted to play when we did trios the other day. I really wanted to play like more of a support warlock where I was focusing more on like keeping my teammates buffed up. But they kept drinking regular protections instead of magic protections. And even though I had Eldritch Shield, if the, I figured if they were using protection, they wouldn't want me to overwrite it. I didn't really end up buffing it, buffing them up at all. What's the minimum MH to get one extra? So it's like 10% scaling. So you need 10 MH to get one more health. So to double your healing, you need 10, 10 MH basically. All right, I'm out of here. This is this is dead. Ain't nobody here. I done. Unkilled them all in the last game, or that random guy tornadoed all of them in the last game? Spell predation is cool. Oh yeah, dude. Hard counter buff ball with spell predation. Easy. He was alive, bro. Okay, so he is by that other static. Damn it, dude. <sighs> Didn't go up north. Should have gone up north. Takes a quick headshot on the way out. Yami was blushing over spell predation use. I was blushing over Yami freaking clapping everybody. What kind of numbers do you aim for in damage? Uh, I like, I mean, it depends. Like, you always got to think about what gear level you're at and, like, how much you can afford. But this kit's doing, like, 33 damage, I think, on the dummy. Or 30 damage. Between 30 and 33, and that's really good. If I can hit 30 and 33, it's an excellent, excellent build. Make a demon where the 10 shards with instant spell predation. Oh, waste their 10 shards. Yeah, well, I didn't, we didn't run into any demons, really. Did we? Maybe we did, and I just didn't use it. I think we did, but he was, like, ungeared. All right, well, it is getting kind of late, boys. It has been a sick stream. We, uh, we got even richer, I guess. I was about to say we got rich, but I was already kind of rich, so I'll probably get some more gold bags or something. I don't really know what to spend my money on at this point because... The kits, I mean, this kind of stuff, like nice pants, are really all I need. <laughs> They're really all I need for a good kit. As long as I have some nice pants and some good movement speed, I'm chilling. It's like the Joker, dude. He's like, gasoline and whatever the hell are cheap. That's all I need to burn the world down. That's all I need is some loose trousers and some magic healing and overhealing and, and freaking light heal. Lesser heal. Yeah, definitely tomorrow we're going to have a sick bid. Um, there was a decent amount of PvP, so I think it'll be no problem. It'll be no problem. Our next stash. Oh, yeah. Oh, bro. But look, look. I need so much freaking... So many gold bags to be able to do that. But yeah, you're probably right. I do need the, the next stash because this was a problem. All right, GG's, guys. Shout out to... Everybody who came to the stream. Shout out Party Chip, Dustin Roberts, Lifestyle, Matt Joe, Loop Lock, Pix, Samuel F, Matt Joe. Wait, I already said Matt Joe. John Vargo, Ben, Aceron. Y'all are sick. Also, if you guys want to continue the uh the dark and darker content, I'm pretty sure Modex is still streaming. He's a sick, sick rogue that I highly recommend checking out. He's one of the best players I know. And uh yeah. He's still going if you want to if you want to hop over there 
But GG's guys. I'll catch you next time.